Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea of how I could get this to work. Mm hmm. Yeah. Oh, you should bring it back to that title screen. Sure. I'd recommend playing doing Phantasma first, to be honest, so you can carry in the finger into this game. Is the finger better than the gun we have? I mean... Probably nerf the gun we have in this game. <laughs> oh, you're yeah, probably right. Let's see. We can't go to Phantasma, though, guys. We promised we'd play that with Eric tomorrow. Right. So we can't We, we can't, can't do, do that. that. He would be fucking pissed. <laughs> Why do you all hate Eric? We honestly thought this is an arena game, so we could play it in any order, but no, it was a story. People were like, what are you, stupid? Of course it's not an arena game. Get the finger off. Like, it says a title. <laughs> they make arena games with armored car. <laughs> oh, Dan, why are you so stupid? <laughs> like, I don't understand. <laughs> I oh, forgot God, I was playing a game. <laughs> they nerfed the ammo of the finger by, from 1,000 to 200 in this. That's insane. For the finger? I didn't know I had 1,000 ever. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm, for anyone who's curious, I am searching up memory cards based on their SLUS number because <sighs> the SLUS number the number that lets us know okay, here we go I figured it out we're getting there okay the SLUS S-L-U-S every PlayStation game has a unique SLUS number huh so this memory card stores them all <sighs> okay. under the SLUS number of each thing okay all right so all I have to do is find out which of these is Master of Arena. Which okay. I'm just looking at. Okay, so there we go. That one is ma okay. Yes. Bring that in here. <laughs> Copy this into the name. Delete. Yes. Get oh. rid of that shit. I guess it doesn't matter if we end up not being able to take the save dash from this one back to Phantasma, because we can just use the one from one again and put it over there. Yes, because I did copy it. Okay. Good. Like, I'm leaving the original file in the Master of Arena, or the uh, Armor Core 1 section. We're good. <laughs> We're good. Okay, this should work. All right. Pray, chat. Pray for me. Hold me before your God. <laughs> Pray to me, Jack. <laughs> obviously, the rest of the night, Bob. Uh huh. Should be us playing versus. Oh, obviously. That's what people. Okay, yes. great. Oh, thank God I'm smart. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> yeah, right. So apparently we got the finger for beating the arena in the previous game, so whenever. So we probably wouldn't even have done that. Probably not. Yeah, Unless it was really advantageous. Oh, look at this. EX Arena and Arena? It's 3D now. It is 3D. You've got mail. Trust. Congratulations. How does it feel to finally be a Raven? <laughs> I'm your Raven's Nest contact and the person in charge of handling negotiations with requesters to sort out your missions. Orders must be followed to the letter. Your first mission is already available. It shouldn't be too difficult, but remember to be wary of any unforeseen obstacles. Exercise caution at all times. Bob, right. you're at the end of the email. You can't hit X again. Are you insane? I am insane. Let's make sure it actually brought my sh my back in. Okay, <laughs> that's him. Uh, we can change out the fucking legs so we yeah. can have the good laser. Or actually, real quick, before you do that. Oh, yeah? Check if you can just hold it. Oh, so yeah. They, they might have, you know... I feel like there's no way, but... 
And this it's kind of fucking hilarious. Yeah, yeah okay, damn it. It's impossible. It's kind of fucking hilarious that these motherfuckers, like, reused all the same assets. Yes. They're like, this is a new it's, video. It's game. very from soft. They don't, they're very, they're very thrifty. Wait, now we can't. Oh, right, because we have the uh, extra back stuff. Okay. We Dan Bob, are you in VR right now? Are you just watching us in VR? That's the one that's absurdly large. Yeah. I need to let people know we're playing Master of Arena. <laughs> you know, my luck, I'll need these rockets, not missiles, so let's just jump in. I, shouldn't... I mean, our gun's gonna favor us yes. whatever we go up against, so it hardly matters. Oh man, I want a higher resolution version of this. No, I just watched the animation show. Oh, okay. Eliminate fugitive. Oh, this is straight from Lana. We've Lana! 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 <laughs> We've received a request asking for assistance in tracking down an escaped criminal. Ooh, fugitive is a chronic corporate hacker. Gets hijacked an armored car and locked himself in the bot botanical zone. He hacked into the facility's security system and all security MTs are now under his control. And its capability of single MT is no match for an AC, though they can be used to be a nuisance when encountered in groups. Immediately destroy all MTs you come across. The instructional data has been prepared. Your goal is to capture the fugitive. You have permission to take him out if necessary. Oh, so we could potentially just capture him, not kill him. Well, that's cool. I like that the loading screen's a little more involved. Safety level 94. Now, is Combat that a high safety engaged. or a low safety? Oh, no. We are monitoring your status. We'll contact you if the need arises. You sound like an AI voice. As this is your first job, make sure you proceed with Don't care. worry about it. That is all. Are you my girlfriend? No. <laughs> can, can I marry you? <laughs> Are you a hologram I can marry and then in a, in a few years your service will be discontinued? Oh my god, no. Go for it, man. Even mission one. God, this really is one of the nicest upgrades about uh, about this month over our, uh, Gears of War. Yeah, no, having music in video uh, games is very important, actually. Yes. That's uh, it. That's it in the room. Your your zoom field on the fucking radar is massive. Right. Which is actually really cool. Which is really cool, actually. <laughs> It'd be hilarious if there was just literally no um, upgrade for anything on our Mac. Like this whole game, just we, we don't have to buy anything new. Yeah, that is entirely possible given how fucking ridiculous our shit is. Yeah. I mean, we even have the fucking... We even have the do more damage fucking optional thing. Right. So I'm excited to see if that's the case. Gonna let the Discord know we've changed the game. I'm just like, are are there any Armor Core games that have a story? Where they all like all the arena ones actually have a story mode? Uh, I'm pretty sure Last Raven or Nine Breaker doesn't have a real story. I think it's all arena. Nexus Disc 2 has no story, but that's the second disc. The first disc has a story. And also, Disc 2 has a story in as much as it's letting you play the, the missions that are stories from older ones. But yeah, that's why, that's why Nexus is the best one. You get a whole new armored core, and then you get a best of. Right. And that's really neat. It's 
Silverman says, oh man, why did I never have this game? I'm so disappointed. <laughs> did you actually pay that ridiculous price for Nine Breaker, Dan? The person who owns... <laughs> we sure have that headpiece. Uh, the person who owns that store said they were okay with lending it to me for the month. I don't fetishize owning physical copies of old video games. So I'll probably take them up on that offer. I, I did, however, buy two, another age, and three for about 30 bucks each. I think I'm the only person who played Formula Front on the PSP. Probably Big Nerd Sam. Uh, my friend's group had a lot of Armored Core fans, or a larger than average number of Armored Core fans. <laughs> None of us. None of us bought that. Yeah. Eric yeah. even played three on the PSP, <laughs> which is insane, because look at that thing. It doesn't have enough fucking buttons. No. He did that. And even still, none of us, none of us played fucking Formula Front. I wish I could do that half around. Retro Nutcase says, you know what bugs me about Armor Core 2? No analog stick support aside from L3, R3. Yeah. It is It is very much a launch title. Yeah. Why does every song slap? Uh, FromSoft used to make games with really great music. Yeah. How we doing? Armored Core 2 has mouse and keyboard support, at least, unless that was one of 2's expansions that did that. That might have been another age. That seems insane. Silverman says, if I recall, during the development of Armored Core 2, they didn't know the DualShock was going to be standard, so they erred on the side of caution. Yeah, that, that, that makes sense. Sony absolutely would fuck up and not communicate that properly to every dev, and... Uh, they made this for launch in Japan. They made Armored Core 2 for launch in Japan. Right. So that's so. not even just an American launch game. So it's even earlier. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. The thought that it wouldn't be standard, though. Retro says, I love Dark Souls, but it kills me knowing it was a death knell for the rest of the stuff. Yeah. I yeah. Didn't, like, I would probably not care that it's popular and I don't enjoy it and everyone thinks it's the best thing since sliced bread, if it weren't for the fact it killed everything I loved that they used to make. Yeah. Yeah, it really sucks. No? You're not doing that? Oh, 100% Silver Rain. Honestly, I never found the lack of analog stick support. That never bugged me. Like in two? I don't know. Is everything you love they used to make just Armored Core? No. No, FromSoft made a lot of neat stuff. I mean, I like both Eternal Ring and Evergrace. Eternal Rings... If, if, if they made a Dark Souls where everyone was a Sorcelator... <laughs> That's what it, that's what an Eternal Ring successor would be. But yeah, they also made Otogi, Metal Wolf, Chaos, and Echo Knight. Yeah, yeah, they do a ton of stuff. They did yeah, a ton of dur stuff. during sixth gen, they did a ton of different things. I've actually never played Chrome Hounds, Tommy. Not. Yeah, somebody said Tenchu. They didn't make Tenchu. They might have made one of them, though. I can't remember. I feel like it, they didn't, though. Like, K2 is the one they published. Was I a big Otogi fan? No, but Bob thought it was pretty cool. Yeah. There must be a control device for the gate somewhere. Find it and destroy it. I think I went to the room with the control device and couldn't and figure just... out how to activate it. So I ended up going all the way back to this. Let's go. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You passed it up a while ago. Yeah, I was in there and looked at it. I was like, this is a neat looking thing. Do something. <laughs> they made Tenchu Z. Oh, did they actually make that one? That's what chat's saying. That's the only Tenchu I haven't played. 
It's a uh, multiplayer focus and it's super weird. Dude, drop. That's how you unlock things. You beat thing. You blow up control panel. <laughs> and three says retro, not case. But I think that was no, that was K two. Yeah, that was K two. Yeah, I, are you sure Z wasn't also made by K two? Because it was published by them. Monty Rob says a little off, a bit off topic, but I like when Polyphony made uh, Omega Boost. I've never played Omega Boost, but it looks fucking immaculate. Absolutely incredible looking game. Absolutely stunning to think this is a Gran Turismo, people. I think I think you'll probably make it through just using your laser rifle. I can't imagine the first level of the game being long. And they got a rave going on in here. That is true, Fuckboy Slim. Uh, FromSoft did make that Palico game on the 3DS, weirdly enough. I always forget about that. Did that even come to the US? I feel like it didn't. Complete Face says, Tenchu Z isn't actually multiplayer focused, which is weird that that is the narrative. I remember when I booted it up, it's like, make your own ninja, and then it didn't have, like, real missions in a normal feeling way. So I hmm. thought that it was. Understandable. I get it. Yeah. That's when the tiny robot said to Bob, who's Steve Jobs? <laughs> Got him. I wish Shinobi Do shipped on a platform that uh, could have survived in the States. Yeah, they just didn't bring over the PS2 version ever. Or the PSP version. And then and then they brought over the Vita game, the yeah. sequel. Yeah, it was like, guys, why? <laughs> oh, it's auto control now. Yeah, that's, that's kind of weird. Oh no, a raven. I'm no match for one of them. And then you blow him up. Me. I'm leaving now. <laughs> you blow up his dick with the sniper what? gun. <laughs> Another one? <laughs> oh no. Ball. What's a top ranked arena AC doing here? What? <laughs> I heard you've been looking for me. <laughs> I heard. I don't care who you are. No one can defeat me. Oh, he's so cool. What a cool guy. Holy shit, He's Eric's missing out. For, huh? I need to talk to you later. Return to base. <laughs> Battle over. I heard you Combat were looking for me. Disengaged. What a what a great voice. Yeah, wow. Yeah, you got a little bit of money. A little bit. You can you could almost make it out in the giant pile of money it just landed in. <laughs> It was, uh, quite something. I saw this cutscene a while ago on YouTube, and I thought it was a shit post someone made. <laughs> That's completely fair. Yeah, no, I get it. Is the yellow one male? The white one's male. Arena. You got this. When we first met on the network, you mentioned becoming a raven because there was someone... You said ASL. <laughs> there was someone you wanted to kill. AC pilot nine ball. Pilot. Hustler <laughs> one. Top ranked AC in the arena. That is all we know. All that is needed for you to participate in the arena is a corporate sponsor. This opportunity will present itself eventually. Let me warn you though, anyone who attempts to face nine ball in battle will surely be destroyed. Have you seen my Mac? If you're willing to risk your life, I can arrange it so that you one day will fight him. That is all. Hell on is up. Get revenge. Spoilers. Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Wikipedia. <laughs> At some point, I I should have stopped reading, but I just I was just like, excuse me, the the arena game has a plot. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you can't fight in the arena without brand support. Otherwise, you end up like that guy in Bell, where all of his sponsors disappear, and he just goes, "No!" 
Why did you do this? I used the gun you gave me. <laughs> and you need to look up official art, official art of Hustler 1. Destroy the Berserk MTs or recover meteorites. What this meteorite you got? Of course, there's RG Industries. This mission would pertain to the anticipated impact of a meteor with our planet. The meteor's, <laughs> <Catch ex> it. <laughs> a meteor's existence has long been known, but it wasn't until just recently that a discovery was made indicating that the meteor may contain rare materials. Or sorry, minerals. RG Industries would like to recover the meteor, but there's a problem. Several of the competitors also want possession of it. They're willing to fight for ownership. Your mission objective is to eliminate any units sent by RNG's competitors intent on retrieving the meteor. You must not allow it to fall into their hands. Sure, why not, man? I cannot believe they rolled out Shape Memory Alloy for three games straight. I know it's a great song, but it's so funny. <laughs> this is funny. That's by the way, that's very... also a Nexus. Of course! On disc two. Is it like re it's a, it's redone? A remix. Like... Yeah, it's really good. Okay. Are you approach the top? Are you serious? That is, is that is Hustler One. He's That's... so good. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna we're making that video pick. It's here. Oh hey, this is the trade area for fucking wine. It is. Not oh my god. It isn't. Now Maybe it's now it's system. big hole. Maybe we shouldn't have uh gone back close to win the meteor strike. Actually, what was the name of that that giant hole? Big hit. Big hit. I remembered it and I went, that can't be right. And there's no way they named it that. I didn't expect you all to be in little planes. I thought you'd be out there armor cores. Fucking fucking the Gundam's gonna <laughs> assemble them over here. When's Armor Core getting an anime? Ever. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this big hole is so archaeozoic. He won, just as I expected. <laughs> AC identification verified. It's Regulon, a member of the sub-arena. Regulon? Regulon? What kind of fucking name is that? AC's strength is its rapid fire capability. Stay out of its line of fire as much as possible. Don't worry, I got pretty good rapid fire capability too. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> he was not ready. Well done. Your mission is complete. The rest is up to the recovery units. Return to base. Battle over. Combat system disengaged. Two part OVA based on Last Raven, but it was canceled. Oh, that sucks. Boo. Now you are Hustler One. <laughs> I didn't know there was actually cool art of any characters, like any pilots in Armor Core, so that's cool. Well, I mean, when you hit, um... I can't remember if it's Nexus, 2, Another Age, or what, but they have all unique insignias and names and all sorts of shit in the entire arena. So it was really cool just seeing their insignias and just yeah. being like, oh, this is cool. It gives them personality. Right. Aside from their, their fucking try-hard handles. <laughs> That's uh, that tells you a lot about them, honestly. I'm just saying, if it, I saw his name was Hustler One, and I'm I enjoyed that, <laughs> but then I saw the art. <laughs> Can I try? Sure. I mean, I know I got the best missions in the last game. Like, hey, go in this hole. Nothing will, but hap nothing bad will happen. Part two. <laughs> that was that was really great. I loved platforming. For Zerkim Tease, uh, Bob, do you have anything to say about whether or not these are sane? <laughs> They're insane. <laughs> the, the mission requester is Prog Tech. 
Gregor's tech. Their weapon factory's maintenance computer has malfunctioned and the combat MTs have gone insane. <laughs> The computer continues to produce. I worry that that was about the Pregger's tech joke. The computer continues to produce the faulty MTs, and the situation is worsening. Thankfully, the problem has not spread outside of the facility, but it is only a matter of time. Your mission is to restore the situation at the factory. As long as the computer is operating, it will continue to produce MT, destroy the computer, and then combat the MTs. Let's <laughs> fucking go! You know, the cool thing is we're saving a lot of time on our playthrough by, uh, you know, not slowing down at all. <laughs> like, should we go shop? No, what are you, stupid? What do you think we're going to find at the store? The finger of God himself? Uh, that's how I open doors now, I guess. Let me just erase you too. We going down? Is this... No, this does not appear to be that exact area where I found the gas. That'd be hilarious. It's it, like, you it have, we a, made no new maps. It has Sorry. a lot of similarities, though. I'm starting to doubt myself. Maybe this is that. <laughs> Bob, I'm starting to believe, instead of carrying an arm blade, we should just have the handgun in the other one. Can you even do that yet? Because someone was saying... Oh, right. Someone was saying we couldn't do that earlier, but who knows? Maybe in this one we can Ooh, a proper swing arc for the fucking laser blade. Right? Now, remember, they said not to even bother killing them because it's going to keep spawning them until you kill the computer. Right, right, right. Womp womp. Uh, oh, thanks, Miss Yakimo. So here you go. Oh, thanks, Yakimo. I'm working on it, babe. She's like, don't, don't call me that. <laughs> Damn, not even this one, huh? I call all, all computer AIs babes, though. <laughs> because they're my girlfriend. <laughs> all of them? Yes. I'm not your girlfriend. Yes, you are. <laughs> that proper dual wielding wasn't introduced until sometime after three? Hmm. There's the only dedicated left hand here. Okay. But I, I was going to warn you to put like a gun or something in your left hand by three. It's just a special gun, right? has some off-hand break weapons. Okay. I should probably try this same time. <laughs> Come on. Slow down, babe. Yes. <laughs> Seek the power of Banny. Right. I love that I'm just, like, incapable of opening these doors like a normal fucking person. <laughs> uh, that's interesting. That is not a false ceiling. Excuse me? What exploded? Yeah, it does sound pretty good, Soul Man, just using two machine guns. Because <laughs> you have not fit ammo in the arena. Or, or rather, ammo doesn't cost anything. That was probably four. I feel like some of those fours have a regular mode. If I'm not 100% sure. Are you kidding me right now? Yeah, Retro, I mean, that's why we just use laser weapons. Then we don't have to worry about ammo costs. <laughs> it helps. I see. You tricked me. The game was like, I'll punish you for being straight. Oh no, gay Riddler. Look, I'm just saying DC movies are at a point where if they put a film in theaters called Gay Riddler versus Straight Batman, it'd be the best performing movie they have ever put out. People would be like, this is even better than the Batman. Absolutely. They need to release the Batman again and call it that. <laughs> they sh I mean, sh they should. They should absolutely do that. Fuck. 
Bob, I'm noticing something about the maps in this one. Yeah. Uh, they suck. <laughs> yeah. Riddler, for the last time, I'm telling you I'm straight. I'm straight. And yet, you do them up the butt! Pretty gay, right, Batman? No. No? No? Wait. <laughs> it just seems confused. That's... Hmm. I don't know. I think the, the, the choice of making Joker 2 a musical is very funny and I think could be very good. Oh god, is that what they're doing? I think so. Well, that's... All right. It's a choice. All right. Sure. Joaquin and Phoenix will be delighted. Right. Thank you, Kuma, 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 Kuma. Oh. Cannot unlock gate. Oh. Oh. Another lock gate. I wish you could move the map at all. Mechanism for the gate. I know. I know how this works by now. Right? God, boop, is boop. Every level gonna be this. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about with, oh no, the maps of this one are awful. <laughs> yeah, the immortal we had to skip too because Eric's gonna be here tomorrow to play that with this. Well, not two, but the second. One. Yes, the second. Sorry, they referred to this one as three and it just got me I know, off. I know, I saw. Got you all tipsy, right? Mm -hmm. Hi, Jack, not Jack. Hey, Jack, not Jack. How's it going? Uh, I asked Tosh where her relatives were in the Philippines when I, uh, the short little break I got today between working and the stream. Uh, and she said a bunch of names, and I swear to God, I normally don't have that much problem, but these names were really hard to remember. <laughs> so they're just gone. <laughs> But no, they're not in Manila. Okay, cool. This was a room full of exploding things. Were any of you the key? <laughs> Were any of you the control unit? And I can go on now because I would like to live the rest of my life. Yeah, Manila's very easy to say. The, these other ones were... Not. <laughs> If there's an error, I don't think so. I'm gonna shout out Jack, not Jack. His streams I watch. Uh, Boom. Why is this uh, game made by sickos, Bob? It's like a game made by From Software. I know. What else do you expect? I expect it to be. A little better than this. No pop, Jack. Tried to jump in the armor core two months ago and did have a mission where you have to crash base, but some rooms and just had containers that made you shitty gas. <laughs> yeah. That sounds and like so armor core too. There, there was no control unit in here. Okay. It's not about it, not, it being janky. Yeah, no. It's, it's about... This literally feels like those mines in Demon Souls. <laughs> the, the Specifically the mine where they have the really rare element and ores in the walls, but really shitty rock skin enemies and... Uh -huh. Just really long branching paths that, that, that really don't pay off at all. <laughs> and they know. And right. they think it's very funny. The branches are to upset you not to not to reward you in any way. Right. <laughs> uh, I'll try right again real quick before I explore the rest of this. Okay. All right. I wonder if that was all of them or just a couple or just one. Uh, the last one did one, so this did another. Okay. Um, and it is to the left, 
correct. Yes. No pass through vote. There's no more voting. The, the, the tournament's over. I guess we should get rid of that option at some point. Yeah. But I'll yeah. I'll do it when I hand up. Um, yeah, 7th Gen Wonderland 1. Yep. Kind of nuts because we thought we would need to do another round of voting and then we looked at it and it was like, oh man, the numbers are just... There's no point to another right. round of voting. That would just waste everyone's time. Oh, man. Yes, that doesn't even get to play Devil's Third, which is great. Yes, that will be fantastic. Destroy all remaining battle units. Now go clean up your mess. It's just a fun game. Wish, uh, wish you could escape the seventh gen. Don't worry, Shittenberg. Those are all super interesting games. I'm very excited to play. In this whole month, it's mostly not seventh gen. <laughs> That's true. What is it, four games? But yeah, there are only four seventh gen armored cores, which means it's a very small amount. Right. No, man, a little chaos is not part of armored core. There are 17 armored core games to play. <laughs> Too many. After the 7th Gen Armor 4 game's really good. I did enjoy the uh, 4. I didn't play a sequel to that, and then I played the demo for 5 and didn't like it. So I never played the full thing, but maybe... I, I was really interested in the direction of 5, but uh -huh. the demo ran like absolute shit. Yeah. And I was like, I can't do this anymore. <laughs> is that... Because I, while I like some of the things about 4, uh -huh. I, I don't love 4. Yeah. Uh, it, it is just a really different feel. Ours is uh, 4 answers way better than regular 4. Cool. That's, I mean, I'm nice. excited for every fucking game this month. Right? I'm, yeah, I want to know what's in those, even if they end up running terribly and aren't great. Okay, somewhere in here. My answer was directed by Miyazaki. Huh. How many armor cores are there? Yeah, there's like 17 plus. 23. <laughs> yeah, 23 total, but yeah. Some of those are games like Formula Front which we will not be beating as far as I understand it. Who knows? Maybe we'll boot it up, play it, and go, this is really cool, actually. Wins the Armored Core Souls game? Uh, I mean, it might be what they announce. Who knows? Hopefully not. Hopefully it's more typical. Eh, whatever. No matter what they do, it's going to feel like a, a, a Dark Souls character because it won't... Because it'll feel like a mech. Yes. Oh, that's not true. Armor Core 4 didn't really feel like that. <laughs> it was really weird when Armored Core tried to be, like, lightweight and fast and zippy and shit. Battle it was like, over. why Combat didn't Dark Souls? Disengaged. <laughs> weird. Can we get frame grite as a bonus incentive? We'll see later in the month. Yeah, because there's a ton of games to play. We want to be able to actually get through them. In a month. Yeah, that'd be nice. I mean, I, 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 I don't think it's possible. Right. I guess I should say. This is the first time I'm really hearing about the frame grite. I really want to try it. But... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, 100%. I definitely want to look up pictures and see what that thing looks like. You do that right now, and they just get to see your face. <laughs> You're like, ooh. Oh? <laughs> oh. That was Armor Core 1. I really enjoyed it. Like, I wish I had owned that back in the day. It's, it's a shame that I didn't, and I only got into the Armor Core series with two, so I have no experience with the full games here on PS1. What if I just went to the arena and started mulching people? What would you do? Frame grind did not come to the stage, did it? I think people said that, yeah. Makes sense. The cover art's cool. I'm trying to find anything else. Yeah, this is really, really obviously on record. That's hilarious.
There's a translation patch for it. Okay. Yzumo Materials. Research group was just attacked in top secret files stolen. The attacker escaped through the city's underground passage and is still at large. Security forces have been deployed, but our assistance has also been requested. Find and destroy. Find and destroy the armored car, car that the thief has commandeered. The armored car is highly visible and the thief can't run forever. He must have planned an alternative means of escape. Your target is the armored car. Car. <laughs> Yeah, they, they, they try to trick you a lot with this. Ignore all other enemies you may encounter. Act quickly. Blow up a car. Sounds simple. Yeah, what could possibly go wrong? And then they made the car out of unblow-upable stuff. What? Or not. Nightball comes in and destroys Combat again. Yeah. Engaged. You can't be stopped. Don't mess with Nightball. So do you think... Do you think Project Phantasma is going to have so many control panels at the end of long branching hallways? <laughs> Maybe not. Maybe they didn't get in touch with this one. It's like, we need to make content for this arena fighter game. What, what, what's the easiest thing to do that takes the longest? Yeah, it's like, we need we need to figure out the C room, but for our core instead of Mega Man. <laughs> it's like, well, it's... I know in theory it's a 50-50 chance on whether or not I choose the correct path, but it really seems like a 0% chance. <laughs> I chose the way that led to a door. Yeah, but the door was locked. What's wrong with me? <laughs> Why am I never right? <laughs> It'd be funny if you could just buy the Moonlight Sword in this. Like, yeah, or whatever. <laughs> whatever, fuck it. Everybody gets wine. <laughs> It is move. so funny for us to have a gun this fucking strong in these armored core games. Yes. In no world should a mech that size only go down in three shots that can come out that fast. Those mines. <laughs> yes, and they're moving forward. Yes. Oh wow, this rocket actually looks better. That's actually a good bit. Oh my god. <laughs> this is my life now. Oh, there's a dispenser. Dispenser? <laughs> Let me dispense some rockets? Yes. I'm just gonna go ahead in case I need to. We're good. We're good. Is there any guy in this mech or is remote control? No, we're in it. Yes, I think. Pretty sure. <laughs> Not a guy with a lot of self-preservation instincts, but a dude. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What's that noise? I wish it blew you up. That would have been hilarious. Oh my god. No, that would be too from stuff. Before he escapes. Yeah. Enemy AC detected and verified as Lucky Hopper, a member of the Subarena. Lucky uh, Hopper. He's a mobile four-legged type AC. Be sure not to lose him. These are these are the introduction to arena battles. <laughs> There's a tiny level that arena battle. Uh huh. Oh, Nexus remix is there. Nice. That's a really good, a really good remix. Okay, come here so I can shoot rockets into your mouth until you explode. Isn't he the guy who's trying to get away? Yeah, yeah, he's got the armored core. Blow it up. Combat the armored core. <laughs> Look at him. He's in an armored core. <laughs> Clearly a jeep. <laughs> armored car. I'm sorry. <laughs> get him. <laughs> get him, girl. <laughs> See, there you go. Make it sexy. Make a new armor core that's sexy. That'll sell it to these fucking assholes who don't realize this shit rules. Uh, it's white, so it's the complete opposite end. Thank yeah, you, game. I mean, I, that's definitely a factor for the the uh, Dark Souls. There's always the lady who gives you the level ups and stuff. And then it's, that's true. Parents always go crazy. A corporation has extended an offer to sponsor you in the arena. 
Sponsor is Preggers Tech, one of the companies <laughs> operating stop. the arena. There's one condition, though. You must defeat all Ravens currently associated with the arena. What? The company wants to see what you're capable of. I've done some research, and it doesn't matter who you fight. But remember, they're all Ravens just like you. That is all. Hmm. Hmm. Hi, here, Dress. Do the custom robo thing and have some sexy robot designs. Armored waifus, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, it's nuts that they made our Metal Wolf Chaos and it's so good and just. Yeah, no. no They're like, again. Americans wouldn't want this. No. I'm not going to try bringing it over. <laughs> it's too silly. There's no way Americans would tolerate our hilarious humor about the president <laughs> using a Mac. <laughs> so should I do missions or should I go to the arena? I just don't even fucking know. Wait, attack Chrome HQ. Chrome is back? And ready for battle. <laughs> uh, rumor has it that a group of enemies have infiltrated the cavern in the southeast sector of the city. According to the information, the cavern is being used by a company to store important materials. We think the enemy forces that enter the cavern are after these materials. The target is a Raven AC hired as an escort. Ignore all other enemies. Seek out and destroy the AC, then escape. Yeah, they seriously just like kill, kill them all. Kill them all, Peter. Th this didn't have a reward. I think I have to do these missions to get into the arena. Probably. They were like, kill all these dudes who are associated. Combat system. That is true. How the hell are we supposed to be the master? <laughs> How are we supposed to be the master of arenas if we don't even go to the arena? <laughs> That's true. Man, overboost is so cool. It is very cool. I'm so excited for us to hit two. Is that the end? I don't think that's it, but I don't know. Maybe. He's firing an awful lot for a normal chump. He is. No, that's just a regular MT. That I can delete with three buttons. Yes. Three presses of the square button. You can delete your foe, too. I can't even imagine how this would be to go through without this save file. What an unhinged idea. Yeah, I can't believe the front stop with all of these games is like that, apparently. Because there's like the stuff at the end of the top on PS2 where it becomes yeah. insane and you need a save file. Yeah, Last Raven and Ninebreaker. Like, what do you. That's your audience? All right. Oh, hey. Okay. Evil Kiss? Oh my god, these names. Sure it is. <laughs> How long? He didn't even land. Fine. Actually, you know, I bet. No? Apparently not. I kind of expect them to have, like, an exit route. Just the lower one on the... Oh, God. Pass remote, what game are you talking about? Oh, shit, 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 shit. No! No, there's no area underneath the uh, cavern. It's, it's just I haven't gone far enough that way to see that part. And yeah. It was like 15 seconds, but it really was. A little, a little bit further. There we go. <laughs> Metal of Chaos. Okay. Man, this song's going crazy. Evergrey Skyworks does? No way. This is the sort of music that Dark Souls is lacking. Yes, absolutely. They're cowards. No. Need more howling? <laughs> yes. That's fair. Most music lacks 
the appropriate amount of howling. We've done so many different things to a Dark Souls by in the game. It's really just astonishing that none of them are like, both of these had really cool music. That girl's like the closest. Okay, I give up. Yeah. Where where am I going? Is this just a kill room? Seems that I thought it? this was an alternate path out of that room because it was the quick way out. And apparently it is just a trick. They go, ha ha, we got you. <laughs> you went the incorrect direction, die. Yeah, this, absolutely, I could see this being, like, the Nine Breaker or whatever of fucking PS1 armor cores. Yeah, so that's where I came from, and now I'm coming here, and I think dropping down and going to the left is the speed. Which means if I had enough propulsion, I could probably take this whole level and make it, like, a third as long as I fly up to there, turn right, uh -huh. immediately Battle drop over. into the correct room. Combat system disengaged. There we go. This is three months after Sonic Adventure. Yeah, that makes sense. With being a super late PS1 game. So. So. So if I wasn't filthy rich, how the fuck am I supposed to financially survive I don't know. during all three of these battles? Ooh, new mail. You Tell me him. about Evil Kiss. Oh, it's Burger's time. It's a company that has grown significantly during the recent years. This is largely due to their groundbreaking achievements in AC-related development. A brilliant scientist who serves as the company's head of development is behind a number of their revolutionary parts. The part you received is probably one of these. Oh, I did get a part. The arena is nothing more than a convenient place for ProcTech to advertise. So take care and don't let them take advantage of you. Should your rating increase, Due to the success in both the missions and the sub arena, you may be called up to the actual arena. That is all. Good day, I'm a representative from Prog Tech, and I have had your, the privilege of observing your performance. We have taken note of your abilities and decided to sponsor your entry into the arena. Please accept as a small gift 50,000 credits and an AC part we have developed. We look forward to your success in the arena. Oh, so really, we just needed to kill one dude so there's room for us in the arena, not kill everyone. <laughs> I know, they they phrased that very strangely. Yeah, that was uh, not well translated, as it turns out. Oh, wow. Disc change. <laughs> yeah. How many PS1 games have you seen a menu option that go change the disc? Yeah, I know, right? You want to do this? Change the disc. So, okay, normal arenas here, though. What a, what a weird reason to have a second game disc. Yeah, I know, right? Your objective is to escort a marine transport battalion. You will board an RGE Industries transport submarine and accompany it to its destination. RGE Industries has become a target of recent terrorist activities. We believe that another attack on the company is imminent. We have no way to predict what problems might occur en route. Therefore, be prepared to handle any circumstances that may arise. Yeah, I don't know what the uh, thing you got was. Did you save too? I don't yeah, know. I have no idea what the thing I got was. It might have been a lifesaver. It was weirdly shaped enough to be. Yeah, I think, like, my theory is that. Okay, remember some corporate art being decent? Okay. This isn't Armored Core 3. This is the third Armored Core. Do not call this Armored Core 3, please. Yeah, there's... You're going to confuse the shit out of people this month. But yes, this is the third Armored Core game. It is clearly a very much budget expansion sort of thing. Yeah, they, it's kind of like when Dynasty Warriors did the, the Extreme Legends games. That there's yes. sort of expansion packs. Yes, 100%. This is that. 22% already. And they uh, seemingly don't have a lot of missions, huh? Yeah, I guess they're like, made them super hard. Not gonna check what this thing was? No. Oh. Um, <laughs> I, I'm practically Goku Rose over here. <laughs> uh, your objective is to. Yeah, 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 Protect the sub, do it. I should have swapped the rocket launcher out for the missile launcher. Yeah, but you might be underground. While I'm guarding a submarine? Yeah, you could be in an underwater cave with water. 
No, I'm standing on top of it, blocking things for blowing it up. <laughs> Good thing walls. the submarine's up there and I'm in this cave and you're coming for him and I'm here with you. It could be parked in the cave. Our submarine cannot submerge due to engine failure. Please take care of all hostile forces while we make repairs. Well, I, I appreciate you stopping the cinema sin from going off. I appreciate the explanation for why the submarine isn't underwater. Right. Worst genre of Armor Corps mission. <laughs> yes. Well. I'm not sure if high or low safety is good. I'm not clear on how those numbers work. Very unclear. I think it's just they they know and won't tell us. <laughs> well, hopefully oh there god. aren't there aren't a significant more than forty. Oh my god. Apparently, they had opinions about me trying to board this sub. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like there's no reason to even try without the missile. Whoa. Our submarine is unsub. Please fix it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Subbent. Mission failed. Combat system disengaged. That was rough. Yes, yeah, maybe with the missile launcher that locks on to up to six things or whatever, we'll be good. Maybe. So did Gundam stole this or the other way around? Uh, well, Gundam's from the 60s. 70s. 70s. Yes. Mm. We kind of, most Gundam stuff came out <laughs> before 1990 for original Gundam. Add another 10 to that digi. <laughs> mm. 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 It's really weird that it shows the sortie amount, but doesn't specify that that's the save from the other game. Right. Do right. not lord load this one. Was it 79? Yeah, it was 1979. Oh, that's practically 80s then. Yeah. Okay. Why does it look like a Scooby-Doo cartoon? Uh, it had no money. <laughs> wow. It, it was actually hideous for the time. Shock! <laughs> I know, right? But it can't be bad. I love it. <laughs> yes, exactly. Star Wars was 1977, so the lightsabers were spread from there. <laughs> no. There's no way. What a pleasant sound. <laughs> huh. Overweight. Oh, no, man. they changed the specs. How could they do this to us? Maybe, I mean, maybe. we're only eight over. Okay. Wait, no, we're 108 over. Jesus, maybe, fuck. Maybe the other radar is a lot lighter. Switch down. <laughs> what? For this mission? All yes. right, I guess, yeah, yeah, I'm moving much. Yeah, I'm not moving much. I'm firing a lot of missiles. Yeah, of course, energy just sort of predates Star Wars, but I mean, they definitely populized it heavily. <laughs> it almost certainly is what influenced them being Gundam. I don't know. I think I think Star Wars stole it from Tenchi Muyo. <laughs> yeah, I guess the lower the number, the more dangerous it is. The gun you have got nerfed by making it heavier. I do it. Okay. How dare they? I could have worn the goofy legs. You could have. Be careful. But then you couldn't have the gun. Our submarine cannot sure. submerge due to engine failure. Please take care of all hostile forces while we make repairs. Combat system engaged. Your AC will be impossible to recover should it fall into the ocean. Avoid this situation at all costs. Don't drown. I try to avoid drowning, rather. Uh, 
Wow. This is really annoying. Yeah. They were a lot easier when I just shot them to death. <laughs> Guess it's a little too far away for that. I'm boosting, but I, I'm stuck. And oh, okay, man. this is wow. This is insane. The final game released for each of these series, like each version of On the consoles, War, yeah, is going to be uh, rough, evidently. Freaking things, distractor missiles. That's so annoying. See, I thought that too, but then they kept dropping it directly onto the sub and it seemed to do damage to it. So oh. I don't know. Ah, no! I couldn't Consistent. even see it. I know, right? <laughs> Most of the screen's an explosion. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> okay. I think this fish might just suck. Maybe. No Unclear. <laughs> I'm going to try the other mission. Sure. Maybe you don't even have to do this one. <laughs> Oops. Wait. No, that was yeah. Right. <laughs> you can see you're wearing plot armor. Well, I was wearing plot armor, which is why I will now rest at the bottom of the ocean for a century before someone awakens me <laughs> by discovering my coffin. <laughs> put more missile launchers on the ship after the first set got taken down. Yeah, that is really complicated. Man, I kind of want to try it one more time. Sure. Because I had an idea about legs. Uh-huh. Come up here. That. You could look for something that's better for all the mid-range combat you're doing. I get a different gun than like hold. a sniper rifle. I don't know if the sniper would work because I'm not sure how how much range you can get when your legs are like this. When what? When your legs are like this, I'm not sure if you can hold rifles. Oh, okay. But you said I don't know how much range you can get with legs like this, and I'm like, what would that have to? Yeah. Oh yeah, your plasma cannon. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? Fucking obviously the missiles aren't very effective. On gives me at least combat vibes. Cool. We're gonna try that. Have a good one, man. Take it easy, man. I need to watch the bungle. I kind of don't trust anything to me to work on, though. <laughs> Wonder why that is. It's a mystery. I, I bet it's completely random. It has nothing to do with anything you've done as a person. Yeah. Experience. Um, he considered you're possibly just a bigot. <laughs> you don't like one Japanese creator? Sounds like you might be a bigot. <laughs> I'm concerned about the thing that seems to hate women. <laughs> yeah. Bob, you need to understand that if you if you're worried about women, you're already racist against the Japanese. Oh no! Rip. And not just Tamino. This is definitely not just Tamino. We promise. Marcus is pretty sure there's little to no pedophilia or blatant misogyny as a bungle. Are you sure Tomino worked on it? Yeah, I was like, is this one of those things where they put his name on it and he didn't actually do anything? <laughs> Holy fucking shit. Okay, dude. Very funny. Very funny. It should be a way to pick what up the What happened? <laughs> okay. If you're going to have the bottom of the spit,
Do not say when I go this far into the water that it's like, uh, you, you died. You're already dead. <laughs> it already happened. What in the hell am I supposed to do here? Oh. This is insane. Maybe you can destroy the whole ship that's over there. Like shooting, not even the guns, but just shooting it. You know, I've, I've known about Zamungle. I don't remember King Gamer. Hmm. I, I assume that's some other mech show he worked on. Another Dark Souls thing says water is basically a bottomless void. Yeah, it's the same idea, but at least, you know, you're a giant robot. I guess in Dark Souls, you're usually an armored dude, but you still fall in if you take all your clothes off. I mean, both control light mechs, so... Yeah. System engaged. I know someone in chat saying that uh, Lucky Star was coming back. I was like, oh, that's great. I don't know if I ever finished watching the original show. I should do that at some Wait, point. Really? Yeah. I think I did, but I'm not 100% sure. Whoa, people are going crazy up here. They're having a time. If anyone chat knows, does it? Oh, the manga's coming back. Okay. That's weird. I, huh. Is it still going to have a catchy theme song? <laughs> well, I mean, it's a manga, so. So, no. yes. <laughs> oh, why not? Did they not get that's the whole reason people watch manga? <laughs> Did not consider. Jesus, this is insane. This is. This is truly nuts. I keep sitting here thinking, well, maybe I'm just doing this wrong, and it's like, I don't know anymore. <laughs> I mean, look at this. Is that best one the intro to Lucky Star, the, the end of Lucky Star? Because if it is, I will, I've seen it. Did you see it? I was on the bow perfectly fine, and then one frame, mm -hmm. no movements happening. I clipped to the right and through the ground. I'm like, but I was completely stopped. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> I don't know. Dude, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do to deal with this at all. Yeah, I don't know. I just tried the other mission. Hope you don't have to beat this one ever. <laughs> this, is, this is absurd. This is giving me some real, uh, give me some real Last Raven vibes. Just turned to a barely mobile turret. <laughs> I mean, if it was that easy, I would have done it by now because, man, I've definitely made mechs in the Army Corps series that were that. Yeah. And just could solve a fucking problem. <laughs> like long range lasers, but like. Jesus. That was intense. I mean, the thing is, I'm getting so stunlocked by all these explosions that I can't even focus to do the long range damage that I need to do. Right. All right, what's this mission? We have pinpointed the location of the base that terrorists have been using for their strikes against Isaac City. Your mission is to attack this base. Base's location is an old castle in the northwest sector of the White Land area. The castle, now a fortress, is protected by many gun emplacements. The gun emplacements surround the entire fortress and will attack if given a target. Do not let your guard down, even for a moment. Nine emplacements, huh? Left for four hours. How has AC evolved? Uh, well, we're playing the third one now. Yeah, it's a not super Armored hard Core expansion. Three, though. Yeah, no. We're playing Master of Arena, the highly budget We've arrived at the combat area. third PS1 we'll game. As soon as your AC is deployed. Tomorrow we will be playing the second Armored Core game, which is also combat on the PS1, engaged. Uh, with Eric. It was his first one. It's called Project Phantasma. I'm very excited. Something tells me it is not as cracked out as this. Right. It'd, It'd be really hard. hard. Yeah, it is not easy to be this level of coked out. 
Which admittedly, that submission was really the absolute peak. Yeah, we didn't. Yeah, we didn't burn through three. This is we just skipped the third one. <laughs> and we only beat one. Right. What, what is? Oh, don't know. they're inside. Oh, no, wow, they're wow. not inside. That is a bullet effect. <laughs> they are hitting me with a bullet. The bullet does not exist until it hits me. Yeah, it's like most used to do the game, this game. It's also a banger. <laughs> Yeah, we are able to bring our armor core from the first game. That's the only way we can survive any of this. It's ludicrous. Armor core month is going to make some of these games look a little too sober as we continue to keep doing that. Right. Because there's, there was a very high probability that uh, when you bought a new armor core game back in the day, you had no idea you were supposed to have a save file from a different armor core game. And there's no way to catch up. You're doomed. Right. That is definitely how Last Raven was from my recollection. Okay. Uh, How many games do you import through? Um, we'll have this change out again when we switch to the next game. Basically, every numbered game is a restart for your Mac. Yes, every every number it is. I honestly think a lot of the expansion ones, like Another Age and Silent Line, also require a fresh save. Yeah, I'm not sure. They don't, as far as I know, do inherited files, but I don't know. You know, Mike was, five, was three I could inherit. I'm okay. not 100% sure. It's been too long. Bob, how have you not played Armored Core Another Age in Silent Line? Recently. <laughs> okay, or Orhos says he can bring it from Import 3. <laughs> okay, is Another Age the same way? That's the thing, like, I played those games without a save file. It never occurred to me why you would want to ch cheat at these games, right? It never occurred to me that the normal mode... <laughs> For you to come in with some dude who's absolutely stacked for mission one. <laughs> the enemy has hired a it seemed like Base cheating. Identification verified. It's Stalker, a member of the sub arena. <laughs> okay, so yeah, you can you can import that. Okay. Newcomer. newcomer. This enemy wields an impressive arsenal. One hit can mean instant death. Keep moving to avoid taking damage. Oh no, you're out of your laser rifle. This sucks. Okay, I just gotta find a hallway. Okay, hear me out. I trick him into going into the hallway. Can I get in here? Shit, of course not. You should land. Thank you. Damn it. Oh man. Yeah, not a whole lot of games do this bring over all your stuff from the old game and just anything new. Right. Very unique system, which is pretty cool. Oh. Yeah, this is not going well. Can you redo easier or earlier missions to grind money? I don't think no. 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 And in some of these games, they do have arenas and stuff to try and help you out. But yeah. Not all of them. Nice. Yeah. Give me the old one, too. Oh, no. I'm out of everything. Over. Well, so we're good. We're good. Oh, engaged. thank God. Thank God. All I had to do was just deposit the rest of my ammo. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Still counts. <sighs> yeah, the hack games also do that stuff, which is pretty cool. Yeah, it really, that's oh, one gigantic game <laughs> full of filler split into four games. Because <laughs> uh, it's all one story. <laughs> They're all direct sequels. Yes. Very, very strange. I don't think anyone's done it since. I'm just... There's four games in a row. Take your save file, idiot. Yeah, yeah. It, it's 
it's kind of not common. It's kind of like an MMO in that sense. So <laughs> we keep releasing all these expansions. <laughs> Fucking buy them, asshole. So I mean, in that sense, they're fucking brilliant. Yeah, you know, I was like, I guess that's like Destiny then. Because <laughs> they keep releasing these expansions. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's that that is like an MMO. Yeah. 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 Mm. Oh, it's the only mission left. Come on. Going to the arena. Bibs. It's very quick and very difficult to track, they tell me. We're fighting on the moon? What? Bibs E3D. That's nuts, Farrakhan. I love that it displays my fucking mech name at the bottom. Or my pilot name. Where you at, buddy? Enemy limit their health, yes. That's interesting. I've never gotten to see uh, in these PS1 ones, I haven't yet gotten to see how much damage this gun is directly doing to an enemy. There we go. Boom. Done. I think it's Oh right, they do that really weird thing where they're like, do you want to watch the replay? I thought they did that in these. Is it only... This... Yes, do you want to also do it? I think so, yeah. I already beat the first person in the arena. Yeah. They didn't, they didn't remotely have a chance. Can I refight them? That's weird. That is pretty weird. So can I just... Yes. Weird. I can just choose who to fight. No, this isn't on PS5 backpack. We're using a real PS1. God, I wish Armored Core was on a fucking PS5 back pad. That would be nice. Yeah, it really deserves it. Yeah, that gun was doing 500 per hit. We don't know what that person's energy defense was, though. Mm -hmm. It could have been high, or it could have been low, or it could have been normal. And some brought up Tenchu early. I've just been thinking, yeah, I wonder why that series died after its big release was only on 360. I wonder what could no have caused reason. that. No reason. I wonder if that might have cleared off any potential fans. Oh, God, I'm the best fucking AC pilot ever. God, I'm so... My penis is enormous. <laughs> Absolutely enormous. <laughs> Didn't even have time to get out of the intro of the song. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, there's four Armor Core games on PS3. Cryonic, Cryonic that's the last time they made a... Here's Armor the Core epic game. battle. How do you do it? This is too good. You're so good at this. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Mm. <laughs> These are the sort of tactics we're going to have to train Eric on for Project Phantasma. <laughs> I wonder if that's a game we need to bring our save file into or if it's just better if we don't. Hmm, I assumed it was, and we should do that. What was Dan cooking? Yeah, we'll never know. Damn, it doesn't just instantly bring me up to that rank. Ah. Uh... So what, I have to kill them all? Oh yeah, now shooting. They they don't have PS3 emulation yet. Yeah, it's that's just all going to be streaming for the foreseeable future. 
You know, after um after that decompilation of Jack and Dexter came out, I was like, man, Sony should really just have a division that's doing this. It's absurd that they don't. Yeah, they have so many games. They are they so huge. In, in no world does it not make sense to have an a 100 employee studio just constantly working on that. Yep. Making the PS3 the way it was sure was a mistake. Yon Offspring. There's, there are no shortage of words to describe how stupid it was. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I get... It took me... This is how bad it is. It took me until last year to finally understand why you would ever design it the way you did. It just <laughs> didn't make an ounce of fucking sense until then. Until last year, and then I started to go, I sort of get it. Maybe Ken was right. No, no, Maybe. I never once would say that. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Fuck. You say that three times and a mirror, he'll appear before you. <laughs> physicist who says he survives by calculating missile trajectories and avoiding them. Funky flyer. Luckily, we don't use missiles. <laughs> He's not I ready know, for right? that. He's going to predict these lasers, right? Good luck. Yeah, I mean, 7th Gen's rough because it's one of the only generations of consoles to instantly mulch an entire, like, multiple genres of games. Yeah? Oh, believe me, I'll win this race, motherfucker. It's like, hey, you wouldn't just shoot me to death, would you? That's where you're wrong. Man. Yeah, I don't know if the next Armor Core game, if it happens and then does well, I don't know if that will motivate them to try and get the 4 and 5 off the PS3 or do any uptorting. Because, you know, Armstrong is fairly small. Did you waste all your ammo and then just sat down and prepared to die? What the hell happened? I don't know! <laughs> is energy zero? <laughs> Yeah, maybe he overheated flying around like an idiot, and you're just like, okay, man. <laughs> I'm like, are you are you defecating in your in your chair right now? <laughs> I can hear that from out here. Ah. Oh. Yeah, exactly. We can't even get a bloodborne patch. From stop is 349 employees. Is that really all? Yeah. But that's huge for them. That is huge for them, obviously. What will happen? This is a big deal. <laughs> oh shit! I got mail. Emergency. An emergency situation has arisen. We have a request that needs your immediate attention. Please read the request description for more information. Okay, well I've got to save first. My mom says if I don't save, I'm grounded. <laughs> That's more than Game Freak. Is it actually? You're right. Yeah, because they had... They, Game Freak beefed up so they could release two games at once this year, right? That was what they were saying. 169 employees of Game Freak? Jesus. I know you're making non-HD games, but... Come on. An emergency situation has come up. We'll be sending a mission request directly. The Proctech Marine Laboratory is under attack from, by an unknown MT. The attacker's objective is still unclear. We've already sent in another Raven. He was unable to complete the mission. Full tank. The best he could do was stall the enemy's invasion of the facility. An important company official is housed within the facility. It is vital that he be rescued and brought to safety. As is our right as your sponsor, we are temporarily revoking your license to participate in the arena. <laughs> this mission is now your top priority. That's, that's fucked up. How dare you? Really fucked up, man. I bought this guy wanted to play arena battles. It was on the case. Yeah, that's true. I got two discs full, motherfucker. Let me play the arena. Destroy all enemy forces and rescue our ally from the facility. 
Okay. Huh. Combat system engaged. Oh. I was expecting dropping out of the bottom. No. Not this time. I think a bigger deal show up after you kill these. Yeah. It's like, ah, I'm the, I'm the raven they sent before. I'm actually on their side. Uh, I actually hate prog tech. Oh my god, why? Because I'm evil. Oh, well, that's... That's how black and white anything in the game is, right? Uh-huh. Yeah, he just says, because I'm evil, and then I go, oh, wow. Friend. This is just... Friend. Friend. <laughs> All right. Friend. Hold. You, uh... You think you're doing something there, or what? I assume the idea here is I let him out. We get him out of here. Friend. Is he really friend, though? Yeah, it, it labeled him friend. You just in the nick of time. My ammo oh, reserves just ran out. To you. Oh, wow. Oh, Who man. is that? Okay, he doesn't betray you, but someone else shows up. <laughs> I thought it was going to be Nine Ball again. It just <laughs> blows him up. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been believe? hilarious. <laughs> yeah. That would be amazing. You, why why are you scared? Why are you running? <laughs> I like that Barrel oh, got to say nothing. Combat that bitch was dead. <laughs> I bet my friend is like 20 feet that way, just <laughs> like, oh shit. That was fast. This uh we we kind of mulched these armor core games. I feel like they weren't. <laughs> Like, that battle was probably supposed to be something other than... Keep saying that, and it'll throw another submarine mission at you. Well, you know, the, that mission at least was hyper-optional. What we got? Yeah, Blink, I was actually talking earlier in the stream how much I want to try Spriggan. Hello, my name is Elon Cu Cubus. Elon Musk. I'm the head of development at ProgTech. Thank you for your assistance the other day. I believe the attack was directed at a research group. This is a relatively common occurrence in our business, but there was one aspect about it that bothered me. Specifically, the MT that appeared from out of the water, it would be hard, given current technology, to build an amphibious MT. I know of no group that had success. Possible technology lost during the Great Destruction has been rediscovered. I fear an unknown organization possessing advanced technologies may be involved. Warning. As I explained earlier, I'm your Raven's Nest contact and the one who will supply you with your orders. You will follow the orders you're given and do as I say. Even if approached by a sponsor, you are not to accept any missions without my approval. Don't let it happen again, that is all. <laughs> I actually... No, I'm good. Hmm. Hopefully this thing that's giving me these missions is in the AI. Yeah, hopefully. She sounds so human when she talks to you, though. I mean, mm -hmm. she has to be human. Yes. She sounds pretty, so I like to imagine her as a human. <laughs> mm, very smart. I'm smart. I want to see Rumsoft try to make horror again with, like, Echo Knight and Kuno. Very interesting. Yeah, I don't have not played either of those. I'd be interested, too. Most of the Rumsoft stuff is super weird. It's Destroy great. giant tank. That sounds easy. Few surviving members of a successfully splintered terrorist organization are making a last stand. They're attacking nearby facilities with a giant tank. Your mission is the elimination of the terrorist-controlled tank. It was in the bat. It is in the battleship class and was most likely built before the Great Destruction. Destroy all tank defenses and render it inoperable. This will be much different from fighting ACs or MTs. Be very careful. I have a feeling my strategy will be the same. However. Da, 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 da. Okay, now say the name of the area. ZR. The ZR. We are still unsure of its full potential. Exercise extreme caution. It's like it's like Verdict Day over here. <laughs> With the super huge battles. Yeah. God, they could not run those. <laughs> no, I couldn't. <laughs> Too bad none of that shit's on Combat PC. It's so funny that Demon X Machia jumped right into doing the same thing. <laughs> they didn't run. Like yeah. Fight. 
Holy shit. Jesus. Okay. It'd be hilarious if you could just sit down there with this lightsaber and eventually kill it. That'd be great. Yeah, this is this is absolutely fucking insane. Yeah, okay, the missile is coming from that thing up top. Okay. Yeah, I know. Jesus. Holy fucking Christ. Well, wow, we're we're done. I hope you say it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Combat. I mean, you saw the submission, right? Yeah, yeah. If you already tried this game, that would be show me nothing except you, Dan's you, asleep. Yeah, Dan is completely asleep. He fell asleep an hour ago. <laughs> He's really good at this though. <laughs> Instead of he's completely unconscious. It's the thought. Maybe. Just maybe. It's a little rough to have multiple turrets that stud lock you and a thing that shoots just pisses missiles yeah. into the air. <laughs> That's uh, a little rough. A little. Mm. And that takes even longer than the first game. Yeah, I that I'm really looking forward to the PS2. <laughs> Same. I feel like there's no way it takes that long. Yeah. It's saving a lot of random little things, so maybe it does still take forever. I do have some vague memory of it taking a long time to save. This game is just making me want to see Journey Dropero again. This is fifth. Where's that stream goal? I like both of those games back month. in the day. <laughs> yeah, just start playing random Gundam games. Like yeah. you said, you wouldn't play the other FromSoft robot games. It's true. We did say that, potential. and we're following Exercise through on that. <laughs> we sure are true to our words. <laughs> Combat system. It's just going to be stuck in my head until I get a decent night's rest. <laughs> this was also remixed. Ow. Hey, how do you even avoid that? It'd be hilarious if it just blew itself up when you were standing on it. Yeah, I think they should allow that. Okay, we're using rockets for the rest. <laughs> yeah, because they're probably going to throw something at you. Maybe. I mean, that missile launcher on top certainly sucks enough for that to be like, figure out the gimmick. Yeah, yeah, it does. Figure out the fastest way to get up there before you're stun locked and fall straight to hell. Battle over. Yeah. Nice. Combat system nice. Disengaged. Nice. Thank God. Yeah, if we had better anti-missile tech, that, that would have made that a little easier, but it's fine. Yeah. Yeah, just, that would also help with that submission of like. That feels even worse than that did. By oh, yeah, a lot. of course. It's not even of course. close. Because it's like two different missile launchers <laughs> and a turret. And mm. I'm just like, mm. what do you want? What do you want? You want, you want the moon? Classic from soft puzzle boss. <laughs> yes, yeah, stand on top, kill. <laughs> Rush the bullshit, then cheese. <laughs> so funny because on the save screen, it only shows one save. And on the load screen, it shows three saves. Yes. Better not have as many missions as the other game because then it'll get really confusing. Okay. I doubt... 
Yeah, okay, that's what I was thinking. So we're gonna go back to the arena. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, because it sounds like the main mission of this game is to get up the arena. It's just beat everyone in the arena, so that way nine ball challenges us. Right. With automatic and single fire weapons, he never gives his opponents a chance to get warmed up. Okay. We're going to the water. Nine ball is such a hilarious name. Yeah, he's fucking green dog over here. Nine ball. <laughs> So we're going to trap Eric in ranking all the Kirby games ever made in a three cam video. <laughs> what the? He'll lose his mind. Either that or he just already has it like completely figured out. His head. We'll, we'll just record it on a day where the damage will have returned, Bob. It'll be like, it'll be like no, that Game Boy Advance game is the best Metroidvania. And it was like, oh no, old Eric's back. <laughs> Oh, right. I remember he did, he did change his mind on that. He didn't said he? that, and then he was like, "I don't remember saying that." We're <laughs> like, "You totally fucking did, dude." <laughs> yes. <laughs> how long did you say three and a half hours? Just want to see how it holds up. Yeah. What's up? Apparently, how long did you say for this? Yeah, for this. Yeah, yeah. It was supposed to be really, really short. We're, we're, we're currently at two hours, almost, but not quite, you know, probably more like an hour and 40. Mm hmm Hour and 50. Time to corner Eric. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because that's what my content is. My content <laughs> is a framework for me to confront friends on weird opinions. <laughs> the video is like just you and Eric. <laughs> And here, just drilling him on the whole time. I was like, I don't know. Oh. I hold up a picture of a Yaka video game. <laughs> I'm just like, so Bob, you think this Genshin character is thick? <laughs> and it cuts to you and you're in the Joker makeup. You're like, yes, and I'm tired of pretending I don't. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone who says that is insane. <laughs> Turns out there are lots of Genshin fans. A lot of them are insane. <laughs> That would be so fucking funny. <laughs> I need that video to happen now. <laughs> it's a channel point redemption at any point. Someone can pay like 30,000 channel points to have that pop up on screen with no explanation. <laughs> Is it like well done Joker makeup or is it like the Heath Ledger Joker makeup where it's just a mess at all times? I figure it's sort of well done. <laughs> sort of. I wouldn't say the Joker's Joker makeup was good. Mm -hmm. Like it wasn't excellent or anything. <laughs> Meanwhile, you can make women in Fantasy Star Online 2 that are 30% ass. <laughs> so that's why Eric likes Fantasy Star Online 2. Now I know. <laughs> and he can't, he can't figure out why he can't get into other games. And there you go. There you go. Maybe <laughs> we'll have to explain that to him tomorrow on the stream. We'll just be like, Eric, have you considered that if Destiny let you make your character 30% ass? Hasn't he actually been holding off on playing Fantasy Star Online 2 because he's been waiting for a PlayStation to get it? He got frustrated and stuff. Okay. Because of the PC release, which is fair. Man, it's... It sure is a thing that Microsoft have heavily implied they were going to bring... Or, like, come to other platforms. And then that never happened. <laughs> Did they? Oh, is it on PlayStation now? Did, did they imply that they were going to... I feel like they did the thing of pretending like, oh, it's, it's, uh, it's like it's Xbox. Xbox gets it. They get it. <laughs> and then it was like, but it's also coming to PC. Yeah, of course. Like, so, so you have console exclusivity. He's like, it's launching exclusively. <laughs> and I was like, wow, this is okay. It came on PlayStation. That's crazy. Okay. Yeah, it was pretty recent because that's why Eric even brought that up recently. Okay. Last Wednesday. Yeah. Okay. And you're still stuck in that version that everyone hates, isn't it? Yeah, of course. That's that's the new Genesis. That's the neon Genesis. 
Hey Bob, what's your favorite song that plays at a CVS? Hmm. Very funny joke. I like the part where you shot me with bullets and it meant nothing. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> it's like, I don't need to move. <laughs> I'm like, why are you moving? <laughs> this is just making this stupid. Well? Yeah, I don't know. We're all sitting on the end of yes, the universe. Uh, do they play your out of touch? SCVS? I feel like they would. It seems like something they would, but I don't think they do. I think we just think they would because it's Vice City soundtrack, I'm pretty sure. Yes. <laughs> I literally do they just play dance, dance Hall Days? Dance Hall Days? Yeah. I don't know that song. Okay. I know Dance Hall. Is it just called Dance Hall? Uh, the, the Modest Mouse song? No, not that. What's Dance All Days? It's like some 80s song. Do they say Dance All Days? I don't know how else to describe this. <laughs> Noble, actually. It's Noble, actually. By Wang Chong. Okay. Yeah, that's, that sounds right. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm a giant disappointment. I guess this is evidence that they do not play that. I know, right? I guess this is, I'm being debunked. Uh, I need to oh, man, this CBS. guy's strategy was real bad. As much as I said the last guy was stupid for moving, this one's stupider for not. <laughs> uh, who's that? Sam Bluehawk. Uh, we're doing good. Our record's going great. As you can see, very challenging. Yeah, absolutely. We took our buff as hell mech from one and just walked into the third game, which is an arena finder with the small story mode and uh, just started melting people. <sighs> oh, thank you. Thank you for the 10 bits. Why did you give me 10 bits? We're going to play the second game tomorrow, buddy. Gotta yeah, that was Eric. We got to play with Eric. Eric has personal attachment to Project Phantasma. You want to be stream boss? Jesus Christ, that was easy. You spent 10 cents and now you're stream boss. <laughs> 10 bits, oh boy. <laughs> 10 bits! Uh. <laughs> Winnie sounds like that. He nicknamed himself Thunder. <laughs> really? Because his pilot name is Loco Ghost. Well, that's not his nickname. AC so. is Tollkeeper. We know. We don't put Sounds like he did that. not. He didn't successfully nickname himself that. This guy's kind of dumb, is what I'm noticing. I like Eric. I think Eric Video Games is cool. That's great, Motty. Eggman Robot. <laughs> oh my god. What, have you never seen jumping to the left before? Or? Yeah, it's so much, man. I like that you're fighting in an aquarium. It feels like any spray bolts could end most of your lives. <laughs> I know. Isn't that awesome? That's why I keep <laughs> choosing it. That it's very flat terrain. Yeah. I think he might win. Oh, shit. Wow, he's just he must have damage. energy resistance. No, no, I'm doing about the same damage. I'm out, though. So we're done. No. How did this happen? Start to replay. I don't know what any of these options are gonna do. I think replay will literally show you a replay of what happened. That's the only one I, I have that inkling about. But then yes will do what? I don't know. And then will no that... will do what? Maybe no takes you back to the menu and yes will be like, I'll try again. That's my guess. I think yes is gonna take me to the arena screen mm -hmm. and no will take me to the title screen. Oh, it took me back here. This is the ass, right? Yes. Okay. Continue. No. Keeps fighting. <laughs> what? Look. 
They're insane. <laughs> yeah. No, that... The screen was very unclear on what it would mean. God, his shots are strong. Yeah, no, he makes your laser arm seem weak. Yeah, no, I, I need a nuclear explosion gun. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Yeah, go ahead. Just end it. Yeah. Man, this is nuts. Yeah, I wonder if maybe I should just try to dodge until he runs out of ammo, because he can't have infinite of that. That's true. There's no way this game put a gun in this game where there's infinite or even a significant amount of those. Right. You could just overheat like the other guy did. You could just shoot him to death. No. Just had to overheat. <laughs> what is that weapon he's using? Is he out? No. No, he just shot again. Jeez. It's just a giant fucking explosion of damage. I know, right? Is there a ledge up there? I don't know. I didn't notice the I ledge. I didn't see one, but... I, mean, I saw a building that was kind of up, but... I feel like not high enough to save me from that shit. God. Frame one. Yeah. Nope. Nope. Yeah, this is a PS1 game. The final armor core on PS1. Right? Yes. <laughs> Tomorrow we're playing the second armor core on PS1. Mask of the Phantasm. In it, our pilot will be reunited with the chick he met in high school. He's not the villain. We swear. They're gonna, they're gonna freak out when they find out she's the villain. <laughs> He's so good, man. Jesus. Yeah. Be fucking reasonable. I was doing pretty well for a bit there. You were. God damn. Yeah, they made an armor core based on Phantasm of the Opera. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. That's, yep. Yeah, the first. Phantasm of the Opera is there. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Like, what do you, what do you want? Maybe they sell some really good luck on missiles and you can just kill them with those while flying around like a madman. I mean, we certainly have enough money to buy basically anything, right? Anything, but not everything. Yeah, no, that's different. <laughs> you got to move, man. I know that landing is hard on your knees, but if you don't move, we're gonna fucking die. Oh no. Okay, we're good. No, oh, we're not. No. God, it, it is so close. This is. Does it show you his house? Yeah. Okay. okay. And and the limit. Yeah. Okay. What is that not clear? <laughs> The limit of your enemy. It just makes fucking sense, Bob. <laughs> yeah, I should, I should know. Obviously. I wonder if they sell a better generator now. That would definitely help us here. <laughs> yeah, it would help a bit, yeah. I'm out. He might be too. No. Nope. No, he, he, he's lasted much longer than this in the past. You're right. Hey. God.
this time will be different. The title of the stream still says Armor Core One Place. Yeah, I've yeah. it. Yeah. It's fine. This game might end soon. By the way, I'm not sure if any of you noticed. The first shot I fire, for some reason, goes directly into the ground. <laughs> yeah, I guess having a generator would help, sort of. And it'd be really cool if he also hurt himself with his weapon. Then I'd that just tug his face. Right. And he's That'd like, what happened? Cool. <laughs> no, there's no way. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna go ahead and go see if there's a generator or something. Right, because I feel like there's gotta be something that they... If I just knew what weapon he was using, then I could at least see, hey, is there pieces I can replace with to build out my defense more? Uh-huh. Because... You know, I don't know if it's an energy weapon or an explosive weapon. What, what are these in there? I guess there were like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven left. We're getting there. Do you uh, keep track of the arena track record? Yeah. No, you don't. Thank God. <laughs> Please don't do this to me. <laughs> Take it easy, twist sin. Okay. So I have an idea. Yeah. What if we became a Chungus? <laughs> and take even more of his gigantic lasers? Well, it'd give us a shitload of health to take more of his lasers, because I'm not sure you noticed. We're not dodging them. That isn't happening. <laughs> oh, no. We don't have our other core. Okay. Like, there is no strategy in which I can dodge that thing. It's so fucking nuts. You could also try the faster legs and maybe that'll let you dodge him. We have to quad legs. Yeah. There's anything. And that probably keeps my dude from stumbling. Because he does that weird uh, yeah. when he hits the ground. Right. Oh. Yeah, then you have to deal with having the laser cannon on your back instead. But I can only use that while sitting on the ground. Mm hmm. Which will make it easier for him to hit me. Yes. Or you could uh, <laughs> invest in some good missiles. Because he's always so far off. That's true. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? If I play from his perspective, it'll show us the weapon? Huh. I didn't even notice that on the display last time. are going to do enough damage, but maybe they have new missiles that do damage. Yeah, it's like we haven't looked at the shop basically at all in this game. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, based on everything else in this game, I'm wondering if the shop has anything new. <laughs> That's fair. Was that the Sin Punishment gun sword? No, it's just a laser rifle. It looks like that. Large <laughs> missile. Wait, did you buy two? Yeah. <laughs> this is my winning strategy. <laughs> Each of these missiles does an absolutely insane shitload of damage, so. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we could check if there's a new generator, too, because they really need missiles. There's what? There are clearly new missiles in there, so maybe there's a new generator for sale. Oh, those weren't there. No? No, large missiles were in the last game. Okay. It's just large missiles are a different type of flight pattern and stuff that mm -hmm. makes them even less practical, but since we only have one opponent <laughs> and we're in an open error thing... It's 
visually looks similar. Let's see. 8,500. 52,000. Which generator do we... Yeah, we might still have the bad one installed. Right, because of weight problems. Yeah, the energy output on both of these is higher, even though the, the charge app mm. is higher on the other type. So we may just want to check if we have the really, really good generator in. We have a better targeting computer for these missiles we're about to start shooting. We had the best one we could have gotten, I think. Okay. So let me check. Because I, I actually got the one specifically that was like fast lock on. <laughs> we didn't need the other features they came with. The longest distance. Yeah, but it's know. when they say narrow, they mean narrow. Yeah. So it doesn't say fast lock on, lock on. So I worry. Yeah, yeah, obviously. We'll just, we'll just, yeah, we'll just try. We'll try we it as it is. Oh yeah, that's a good point. I haven't checked an optional part. Excuse. Reduces energy weapon consumption by half. That could have changed a lot back there. Oh hello. Didn't even say anything. Thank no, you. No, they didn't say anything, but thank you, Tolima, for the 1337 donation. We appreciate it. Yes, absolutely. Um. Man. Too bad I'm like, you know. <laughs> it would be funny to just do this and let them keep firing. <laughs> The moonlight can't just be bought. <laughs> 70 bits. Oh, boy. Thank you, True Storm, for the 70 bits. Oh, boy. Uh, 2,800 damage is a shitload. Yeah, it is. Why can we buy this? Because this is the third game. Fair. Like Very good. They're like, we don't want to give you a method to get this in this game. Yeah, I don't know, then. Like, maybe stabbing people to death. <laughs> maybe that's the real thing. Yeah, I feel like... I'm picking it up. I don't know if I'll use it, but... Nothing hard to equip it. Oh, hey, there's the finger. The thing that we were supposed to play the last game for, because I hear it's the good. Yeah, apparently it just shoots like an insane amount of bolts really close range. Well, there we go. We're all ducked out. <laughs> something something in this repertoire better fucking work. Because we just spent almost 40000 400000 We spent $400,000. That's right, guys. If you look at our stream goal, we spent $400,000, so you need to help us get that money back. My god. Okay, so... I call it TSK. Next, going pretty well. This is the uh, second expansion for Armor Core 1. It can be pretty tough. Yes, it is. We have hit the difficult part. But that's okay. That just means we have to go and spend $10 million. And then we'll win. Yeah. I'm feeling pretty good. You know what? I'm feeling so good I'm changing our colors. So do you have the do you have the finger in the moonlight equipped now? Yes. Great. There we go. We get the purple pattern this time. Hell yeah. Good luck. What's the origin of the 70 bits bit? Uh Duke Donuts got donated 70 bits once, said that exact thing in response, and it was fucking hilarious. <laughs> and now it's spreading across the internet thanks to Rig. Yes. See, this is one of those funny bits where somebody helps someone else disseminate a bit instead of being I disseminated a bit to make fun of you virtually. <laughs> the Duke Donuts thing is hilarious. 
Also, it, it, you know, it's made us an enormous amount of money. Yeah, obviously. Everyone, the 70 bits add up so quick. <laughs> no, you got this. this stupid asshole. Yeah, we got the moonlight. Uh, it was really complicated. <laughs> we went, went to the shop. We went to Walmart. <laughs> he said, hey. I feel like I bought it in some other one, too. Like, I think that's really? become pretty common. <laughs> that's nutty. Okay, one landed. Okay. Yeah. Where you at? Ah, how could he? Jesus. 70 bits. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. Oh, that keeps the damage on him. Yeah, it does. You know, if I weren't so damn heavy now. This time. Yeah, yeah this those, time you those got Those shoulder it. missiles are useless. Yes, absolutely. I landed two that whole time. Maybe right. just one. Meanwhile. <laughs> Thank you, True X Storm, for the 70 bits. Is a really good sound. <laughs> no, Sam Blue Hawk, a real person, not a Yu Gi Oh character. Fine. Oh, yeah, this gun. There's Sam Blue Hawk. Oh, you're out. Nice. Imagine if you had shoulder missiles that did literally anything. I know, right? I need to sell both of those. Yeah, large missiles are apparently just useless completely. Yeah, that's why I didn't buy them once in the last game. Because imagine that in a normal mission, I let know, alone. Right? What the sad display you just saw. Large missiles are a meme. That's fair. That's fair. Boys, boys, boys. Boys, boys, boys. Yeah, that's cool. I don't know if I've ever actually used the finger before. That's, that's good stuff. I've used it before and I feel like it's less effective in other games. Like they nerf it even more. <laughs> I was like, why are you mean? <laughs> okay, literally anything else. Yes. Oh, that's right. where's that plasma because <laughs> obviously that would have been better yeah someone's saying the chain gun you mounting back pretty good too yeah I've, I've had good experiences with that in the past uh we're too heavy so here's what we're doing taking off the missiles yeah i guess i could keep these missiles even though that's like really sad <laughs> <laughs> i mean those are still pretty good Hey, Vox. Hey. Yeah, Looker sounds interesting. That sounds fucking hilarious. <laughs> Ideal. That is a hideous mech. The Fights for the love of cold, hard cash. The AC is gold-plated and carries the emblem of a hammer. Oh, my God. That's... It should be a lot cooler looking and not bright yellow, then. <laughs> But I guess we're on PS1. An AC made out of a school bus. <laughs> I don't know. That looks even terrible for a school bus. It's like, is this how British school buses look? I don't know, man. I don't know what British school buses is. Color-wise. So the sorry is terrible, and I should switch back to my normal layout, or setup. Until proven yeah. ineffective. Yeah, true. Oh. He's this? Yeah, he's kicking my ass. Yeah. 
Is this a good game? Yes. Well, yes, Armor Core One's a good game. Yeah. I'm not sure I would, I would recommend Master of Arena to people at large. No. I'm enjoying it, but uh, it's definitely not normal content for an Armor Core. Like I'm spending a lot of time in the arena. <laughs> Yeah, don't don't bring a whole school of kids with you into the arena. It's not not safe. Cold played air conditioner sounds raw. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why did you do this? I'm an idiot. Okay, okay. Cold plate, whatever you want, man. It's so I won't stop you. It's funny how many different games have the abbreviation of AC. What is just Armored Core, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Ace Combat, Assassin's Creed, Animal Crossing. None of them exist. What are those other ones? I don't even know what you're fucking saying. <laughs> Jesse, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> there are normal missions in this as well, Maxiev. Just not as many at And all. it's not the important part. No. Do you guys have a name for your Mac? Yeah, we get the name wrong, Mac. You might see it at the bottom of the screens when I go into the arena. Okay. So I need to get rid of these terrible large missiles. Yeah. Where was that? There it is. Bye. Goodbye, second one. Okay. Let's see. We're going... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I need to buy the uh, energy weapon thing under optional. <laughs> Just that that's nuts for it to take half as much. Like that's worth every fucking cent. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That that uh, that almost makes it seem like they buffed that gun. Like truly the only shortcoming of our ludicrous gun is that we can't have it and these legs. Mm hmm And it only has fifty shots. Awesome! Like the crossover between all the different games with the AC abbreviation. <laughs> yeah, that'd be uh, truly unhinged. I always forget about Ace Combat when I'm talking about ACs. There's also Astral Chain in there. <laughs> well, I, I don't forget about that because people keep bringing it up. I wish I forgot about Astral Chain, but no, sadly no. I take the. I guess you don't need the Moonlight. Deal with not having it. Oh, well, I'm getting rid of the shoulder shit first. Okay, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, we don't need that laser gun. No, now I have to actually crouch to use it, and that's stupid. Right. That's stupid and sucks. Oh, we gotta get rid of two slots. I haven't seen it work. <laughs> it's like, I, I don't think we need the Center for Disease Control. I mean, seriously, we haven't had any pandemics recently. <laughs> Shuts oh. them down. Defunds them. <laughs> yeah, our record game's really cool, Professor Bad Vibes. Yeah, no, the series rules. Uh, the PS2 games are absolutely nuts. You like customizing stuff. Or just next in general. Oh, what it barely part. does anything. To my uh, energy. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Please land, sir. Sir. Sir, please land. I need to put that radar back on. Or get ahead with proper radar instead of just map functionality. Right. Can you, can you fucking stop? Can you fucking stop? Jesus, he's not running your laser beams. How does he do it? You're not. And my missiles. Yeah, the missiles just. Yeah. Why did everyone get such giant nuts? Like, I'm just. <laughs> fucking ridiculous. Okay, I'm gonna rush him. Have you considered an Ace Combat month eventually? That'd be neat. Yeah. Yeah, it could be cool to go through those.
That's a sound. 70 bits. Oh, oh boy. boy. <laughs> I need this motherfucker to land. I'm tired of this shit. Air conditioning. Oh, boy. Yeah. Yeah, you know it. <laughs> that is how I feel with my new car. Yeah. I'm like, oh, shit. Sense. Air conditioning. That's pretty cool. Never done that before. We're using a real PS1 mod with HDMI. This is it. This is it. Running how it would back in the day. Yeah. No Go enhancements. Cooling. What about front mission months? They have to play Left Alive. <laughs> you know, that was in one of those lists. All right, of course it was. Man. Like, at the point we play front mission games, uh huh. It's like, that's a big RPG series. There's so many more important ones to play, I feel. I mean, it feels weird to group turn based strategy and. RPGs into the same group, but yes. Yeah. 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 No, those if are big games. Yes. Heck, even if we're playing other like tactical RPGs like that. What? Well, well, oh, my deck is right over there. But that's one game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the biggest. Probably the whole franchise, because oh god. <laughs> no, for a bit, this is huge. <laughs> Why are you being mean? <laughs> I like a thing so it's popular in my distorted worldview. <laughs> That's cool, Buffins. Yeah, I, I tried to play Left Alive. I really did. Unfortunate that it sucks so bad. I don't have ideas. Yeah, I don't know, man. Maybe there's faster legs now that you can buy that are also still support the weight, like not spider legs, so you can still use this gun and move faster. Maybe. Here, if you wanna if you wanna try some ideas, sure. I am gonna use this from Robbie Rubber. Check it out. Think about like what? Uh, let's see. I should have looked at what legs we have first. Let's see. You legs? No. Our legs. Here we go. So right now, next wave four seven. 4770 seven, 2670 so we down here. Feels wrong that we have the fastest. Maybe maybe I remember that number wrong. What what is this lag number again? 269. Okay. We can definitely go faster than 269. 451. That's only 39. 445. To make my legs quick and try and run up on him with this uh, gun. The one that shoots the big laser. But maybe I should use the one that pisses bullets. <laughs> That makes sense. Better or worse than Vampire Rain? Huh. A freaking work. What's up, not mission? Which one is this dude? Yeah, right? CLG, whatever that is. Yeah. 
Okay. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Don't want to change this. Right past the legs. I guess, yeah, maybe it's a challenge. Oh, Could yeah. also stand for clug. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're right, just scrolling man. through it. It goes clug, clug, clug. Got that. Missiles will never hit. It's about sending a message. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, Meta. Meta Ascension is a pretty good name. How many how many streamers do you follow? And then they just murder your name. Like they can't notice it's a portmanteau between Meta and Ascension. I ask because I always crack up when I'm some I'm in someone else's stream and their mouth just takes a bat to the knees of some name. It is always funny to me. Probably be good to get the radar. Yeah, I got it on there. Okay. Yes. Seeing. Yeah, it, it honestly, with this guy, him and the last guy were so mobile mm -hmm. that it actually became a problem of where the <laughs> fuck did he go? <laughs> Most read it surprisingly accurately. Well, that's good. As it turns out, the first four letters do lead you to meta. Right. But, and even if you just separated the first three letters, you would still be met and then ascension, so. You, you would be surprised. Cool, you've used over a fifth of your ammo and he took a couple hundred damage. Yep. What a gun. There, there we, we go. go. So the real trick is to get him to parallel drive next to you. Why is the AVGN yelling? That's what he's saying as he's firing the machine gun. It's a good thing we had $10 billion to spend on this ludicrous gun, which is now out of ammo. Yes. And now we pray. Did you leave the uh, sword in? Yes, I did. I'm going to go after him now. Back. It's like this piece is right now. I got it. It ch I chuckle when people don't understand that the X in True X Storm is just a space. I mean, that is a... Uh, it's a letter. That's a letter. I'm sorry. You put a letter in the middle. I don't... X, X is normally used at the beginning and end of handles to just be ignored, right? Right. Normally, they're not in the middle of a pile of letters. The only place that you see it not pronounced is like Hunter Hunter. Right. No, that's no it. One, that's no the only it, time. Right. And nobody even gets that right. Right. Digi says, I thought it was an X like Japanese titles. No hunter cross hunter. <laughs> yeah, an underscore. What does that um Thank you for the follow, true cross strip storm. Thank you for the follow, spy family. Yeah, spy family also. Nobody gets that right. I've heard spy X family so many fucking times. Yeah, it's it's one of those things like it's unclear what they want. <laughs> it's almost like the people who, who name these things are doing so in a language that isn't their own. Right. Mm. People usually give up when they read mine. I find that funny, Hudros. I don't know. This neck has worse stab. X, 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 Holic. I always pronounce that as triple X Holic, but who knows? Actually, it's pronounced Hella. <laughs> Fair. Oh, 
Pokemon. So, Nazo, do they mispronounce it as like Nazo? Nazo the Crusader sounds like you're a fucking nasal decongestic product. That sounds terrible. Umbra Munnan says, some say Kai, but the meaning is the same. <laughs> that is unabashedly one of the funniest moments in that entire <laughs> franchise. Uh, yes. It's right up there next to fucking, uh... <laughs> My name's not Axel. It's Lee. Like, that's amazingly hilarious. <laughs> what a good moment. I, I stand by... I stand by Kingdom Hearts 3. Almost, in some ways, I can draw a parallel between it and Gears 3. <laughs> Where some of the other games do things that stand out and make them unique. Uh-huh. And then there's Kingdom Hearts 3, and the only things unique in it are kind of unremarkable in a certain way. Mm -hmm. Dream Drop Distance has some really good shit in it. It's got Dream Eaters. <laughs> it's got dabbing. Yes, there's lots of neat things. And story-wise, I think it's more neat than... Oh, yeah. Than 3. I 3 doesn't have its amazing time travel thing until they try to do it in the DLC, and I actually really hate it there. <laughs> Because it's like, now I can't even describe the ending of Kingdom Hearts 3 ever. Kingdom Hearts month when? I, we, we did all those. We right. did it. Do you want us to do it again? I mean. Hey, hit that number and I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck it. I need to make that camera money back. Yeah, the camera money is. This is a lot of goddamn money. Yeah, that was not an easy decision. It sucks. Do Bro. it with aggro this time. Yeah, I'm sure aggro will just be fine. He doesn't need a real job. No. Come on, come on. I wish Kingdom Hearts 3 felt like a real ending. You know? It is interesting that you say that, Nocturne, because in a way, 1 and 2 did feel more like real endings than 3 did. Yeah. That's, that's interesting and not something I've ever considered before... You brought that up just now. Yeah, it's weird. It's supposed to be the big conclusion to the trilogy, but in a way, it feels like the worst story of any of them. No, not a good ending either. Yeah. That's very strange. That's very strange. Oh, no. I was so it's, close. It, it says a lot about modern media, really. What if you had a cryo gun and you froze him and then stabbed him? Yeah, right. I mean, pretty fucking cool, man. Part of me thinks about just, like, get the fastest leg of existence. Uh, uh, force take everything off. And just to Run try right to back in. Yeah, lube up. You suck it faster and they can't catch you. Uh, but yeah, Melody, me Melody, Memory of Melody or Melody of Memories doesn't add enough. And I honestly don't even know what's in that. And that's fine. I don't need to know. I mean, I don't even not like three. I just think it's not as good as other games in the franchise. Right. And it would have been neat if we got a full console budget version of Dream Drop, and it would have been neat if we got a full console budget version of Birth By, because mm -hmm. both of those would have been cooler than three. And to some extent, they still are. <laughs> yeah, come on, guys. Hit that goal. Kingdom Hearts month, colon, final mix. Yeah, I'll play the ones I didn't play. <laughs> All of them? No. <laughs> All right, let's see. How fast can we go? Is there a faster leg? I feel like there are. 483. The leg, Dan, you... Wait, what, what are they calling? Oh, they're calling the tank treads caterpillar? They under, under the oh, leg yeah, type. They, that's the, yeah, hilarious. at the bottom, it says caterpillar when you... Yeah, it does. What the fuck? <laughs> it's so dumb. That's so weird. It's like... Hey, uh, can I get some tank treads for my mech? And the shop owner's like, uh, worm? <laughs> <laughs> no, that was really good. I love Birth By. Birth By so good. I'd watch you play some of the DS ones. You only watch the movies for those, right? Yes, just a sec. That is true. Those are the exact ones where I was making the joke of, we'll go back and play the ones I didn't play. All of them? No. No. 
What am I saying? I made that thumbnail. <laughs> wait, wait. I'm so close, not, but not going over yet. All right. It's wafer thin. <laughs> just, a, just a little bit more. <laughs> Maybe maybe this makes more sense for this guy. Keep going to mission is like that's because, where they put all the yeah, stuff. Yeah, you would think that's where the important stuff is. Is there some sort of kill box arena? It's just like five feet by five feet. No. Oh, they know. They know. Wait a second. Is, this, is that water instant desk? <laughs> is there going to be a mechanic of like, you can't fly that well, it just falls into the ocean? Was that water? I thought it was dirt. I think it's water over with a bridge over it. I thought it was just a construction left in the middle of dirt, but I didn't get to look at it too long. Yeah, oh, okay, it's dirt. Yeah, that's dirt. Okay. I could leave my shots properly. It's like you can, but then oh, sometimes you can't. It's yeah. the weirdest fucking thing. As somebody was saying in chat earlier, your ability to aim is affected by your arms in future games, but not this one. Okay. None of the first three, because they're all the same game. Right. Oh, that oh. actually would have one hit him. Yeah, it would have. It's okay. Oh, he's, oh no, I'm out. He's so close. No, 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 no. Stab him, stab him. Oh, oh no. Yes. No, oh. he shot you what you were about to stab him. Yes, but this will work, this will work. Uh, uh, okay. I would love for you guys, I would like for you guys to play Chains of Memory and see if I'm crazy for liking that, that game over some of the DS one. Uh. It's, it's so weird. Because Chains of Memories is the Game Boy Advance. One. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it's so weird because they did that remake. And the remake just made it into weird Kingdom Hearts 1 slash 2. Yeah, I'm like, I don't... I would want to play the original, not that. Right, same. Which is ultimately a part of why we did it. It was just like, can we trust the original? But yeah, I really... I really do like Kingdom Hearts, so I am hopeful for 4, because it does feel, a, to me, a little bit like a bummer to go through that great journey I did with the franchise, and then the reward was 3. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> and that's not to say I built unreasonable expectations. I barely had any time to build any expectations. No. Because um, I've heard people say that, right? Like there, there. When I express like I think, I think three's not as good as two. Birth by Sleep or Dream Drop in all these different ways. Like I think two is sharper gameplay wise, right? Mm -hmm. Um. When when I tried to express that to them a couple times a while back now, right? They were like, "Well, you built up a lot of hype," and I'm like, "I barely had time to build any expectations <laughs> for three. We have people in chat who forgot. Cuter Ruffs forgot they announced four. That's fair. They did it in a super weird way where they if just they had, had their done own it, event. If they had done it at an E3. Yes. That would have been huge. Yeah. If Xbox got the reveal of Kingdom Hearts 4, <laughs> that would have been massive. But of course, Square doesn't want to do that because they're looking to be bought by Sony to own everyone who's into JRPGs. <laughs> who every time a company's bought, all they can think of is Sony buying Square and they just sweat. For some reason, Square wants to own you guys. I don't know what's up with that. <laughs> I'd take the paycheck from Microsoft, but... <laughs> I bet Microsoft wouldn't do it unless they were day one on Game Pass. I bet they literally would not showcase their shit. Oh, yeah. Unless Kingdom Hearts 4 was day one on Game Pass. And Disney's like, ha ha, no, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> like, forget the Square angle of this. Disney would not permit this. No. 
we don't even put our own stuff on Disney Plus. Why would we let you do this? Right? Oh, this is it. This is not. I must have to use all these missiles. <laughs> mm, yeah. I'm so full for missiles. <laughs> Delicious. How many games between three and four is a really good question. Uh, because Melody Memories or whatever was already a thing. That's, that's true, but I feel like that's the least it happened between these two games ever. One, it's a rhythm game. Two, it only has like two minutes of story. <laughs> I feel like it's the least this is a Kingdom Hearts spinoff and more of we made a rhythm game based on Kingdom Hearts. Like, right? Right. Um... I would be shocked, Nocturne, if 2024 is even possible for Kingdom Hearts 4. You know, I'm not a hater or anything. Like, at all. That game, based on what they show, is nowhere fucking near done. Yeah. Which is fine. Right. It doesn't need to be. I don't understand the Kingdom Hearts fans who get upset over the concept that it isn't anywhere near done. Right. It's just like, that's just the state of it. That's fine. And that's fine. It's a game like, I want them to spend more time and show less in advance, right? right? Because that would be good. The NVIDIA leak had it at September 2023, so I assume it's delayed like everything else. The NVIDIA leak happened, what, last year or something? I think it's been two years. It's but... been forever since the NVIDIA leak, so... Roadmaps change and stuff. Right. Oh, hello. What? <laughs> Which translated to boo. Uh. <laughs> Don't worry, Bob. It was only five dollars. Okay. Okay. So I would have made sounds if it was an excruciating amount. Thank you for the five dollars, by the way. Yes. I really so much. hope everyone in chat right now, when the Gears of War ranking video comes out, please just give it a chance. Yes. I can frankly say. Watching that video is a much better experience than playing those games or watching those streams. Yeah. That is a good ass video. It is taking its sweet time being made. I'm only a third done with the first pass of editing. <laughs> uh, but I'm working hard in between. God, what was, what am, I think, I think podcast day was a 24 hour work day for me. Jesus. Yeah, wake up at midnight and just, all day. Um, there we go. That got him. Nice. Good job. You wrecked his ass that time. <laughs> Apparently Sometimes. having these like walls anywhere near him makes right. him trick he, up a little. He needs something to stop him. <laughs> I don't know if I can handle you shitting on Gears of War for another hour and a half. That's fair, Sticky Bird. You, you need to hit back. But, unless you wanted to see. Okay. No, that's fine. Um, you want a thumbnail for that? Made it look like a tier list video. I think it would be funny. You know, I didn't even think about the thumbnail aspect of this. I'll have to talk to you, Justice Egg. Because I'm totally cool with... Oh my fucking god, Bob. What's up? I don't want me to uh, get it. Uh, you can get it. I just wanted to point the camera at 70 it. 70 bits. Oh, boy. I just wanted to point the camera at it. Uh-huh. Did I get a full cam view that is actually a full cam? <laughs> that is this weird fractal image. Okay, let's get rid of Excel Gore. Now, you guys see this. Monitor stuff. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he literally just crawled in. Yeah, he just w wandered on in. Nah, it's what the fuck? it's not a snake. It's a worm. It's a big old worm. Take him outside. 
Wow. Things are still not voice. <laughs> I'm so dry. Firm is too. Wow. It's just so dry. Enormous. All right, I can. Mm. I should have gotten more. Somebody call EDM. Disappointed! What do Pikachu's eat? Uh, subs even better than I do. Thank you, thank you, seductive whale shark, for subscribing at tier one. That's a hell of a handle. There's a, yeah, I know, right? I see a worm. I subscribe. Hey, you have a system. You have a system. <laughs> the important thing is stick to it. All right, what's this dude want? Where are he going? <laughs> <laughs> also a member of AC Team Fog. His hunting skills have been compared to those of an eagle. His fucking AC is called Fog. Too. <gasps> Yeah, what's he doing there? Oh, Man, his uh, armor must be really bad. Did one of you guys walk too rhythmically? Bob, were you walking with rhythmically again? I don't think I was. Bob, is that a lizard in the corner of the room on the wall? That is a tiny lizard. What the fuck is going on? They're just like, well, what is this stream? It out earlier. I gotta oh, come God. in. I gotta come in here. <laughs> Maybe the lizard was after the worm, but I feel like that was way out of the league. Like, you can swallow oh, that. No, he fucking died to try to eat that. Yeah, he would. Oh, what is going on? What? Is it more? There's a full scale invasion. There's a fucking spider now. Oh my god. Jesus Why is it like this? Why did you change it to a spider? Because when I look back where he was, it's a spider. No. Maybe he'll eat the spider. I just... No, no. Why do like this, guys? <laughs> oh man. Did you not own me like this? Yeah. Yeah, I saw. That's uh your victory. That's your battle cry. Yes. Battle Pony says, come on, feral dogs. <laughs> Hopefully we've avoided the invasion. Yes, hopefully that's that it. Can calm We're done. Down. The lizard can hang out. The lizard's fine. Yeah, he'll believe or not. Whatever. 
There you go, everyone. I've updated it. But it says Master of Arena. Too late, Dan. We're summoning the Raptors. Fine, go ahead. I'm tired enough. Just let it happen. <laughs> I'm okay with it raining Raptors on my ass. <laughs> I think it's flabbergasting that this game, like, was so easy. Yes. And it just became a fucking nightmare instantly. Yeah. Like, between the submarine and these last few battles. Mm hmm. is like when I tried playing for answer online. Oh. Yeah. I never want to play a pro armored core player. No. Not interested. I know Lord Richter this whole month is a threat. Speaking of which, for anyone who doesn't know, we're going to be live again. <laughs> the Armored Core Project Phantasma, the second game in the series, and Eric's first Armored Core game when he played it way back in the day. That will be 14 hours from now. At 3 p.m. Central Daylight Time. Jeez. Almost like this was a mistake. Might makes more sense to switch to that other loadout for this. Do it the finger. Yeah, I think the finger is a pretty solid strategy going for him. Oh, you're doing it later today? Yes. Yes, we are. I get the impression you don't know what month means. Rado, do you not realize how many Armored Core games there are? There are a lot of Armored Core. We're not even off the PS1 yet. <laughs> hey, at the rate we're going, we will still not make it in time for a month. Right. <laughs> Like, this is the biggest fear of, like, this month is going to be more than a month. <laughs> yeah. Because here's the thing. Armor Core 1 and the two expansions. Armor Core 2 and the expansion. Armor Core 3 and its expansion. Three other Armor Cores. Nexus, Last Raven, and Ninebreaker. Uh-huh. Then Armor Core 4 and its expansion. Armor Core 5 and its expansion. And apparently we owe people us touching Formula Prime. Just going, look at this. What a fucking weirdo. What the hell we got? Each Armored Core Month has a new subtitle? Yes. This one's called Armored Core Month. The next one's called Armored Core Month. Maverick. <laughs> uh, are there any good small missiles we could get? Armored Core Month Operation Poltergeist. <laughs> you know, we're sticking burger. I hope that's the case. I hope Nine Breaker is about us killing Nine Ball once and for all. That'd be nice. I don't mm, want any more cool. Nine Ball. Yeah. We got a real Nine Ball problem. <laughs> yes. 24 if they actually announced the next game that's allegedly been in development since 2017. Yeah, there are like 24 games, 23 excluding the new one they're working on and uh we're beating about 17 i think let me count it up let me just count those okay okay so three ps1 games two twos two threes three other ones making 10 total just by the end of the ps2 then you get two more fours and two more fives so that's 14 games we're beating this month basically unless we in the middle of Last Raven, just go. We're tapping. Yeah, there's a chance they'll just destroy us. Yeah. Are we sure we need to keep going to the arena, or we should go back to those missions? There are three missions available. The plot of this game is we kill Nine Ball, <laughs> 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 and he only reveals himself when we clear the arena. Okay. Now I'm not saying we shouldn't try that. It's clearly not going to make us any more powerful. We will have to no. do that on our own. No. We'll. What? Uh, hello. The guy just teeth I did. That is fucking, fucking rude. You know, I'm pretty sure Armored Core 2 has an, uh, an optional part that makes you turn faster. Sounds right. 
You forgot Nexus Revolution, the remake of Armor Core 1. Is it a remake of Armor Core 1? I thought it was a bunch of different missions from a bunch of different Armor Core. But I do intend to boot that disc. And not beat it, probably, because, you know, we just did that content. <laughs> right. But it would be cool to see yeah, that what, game. What they did. Yes. It's really funny for that to be the one that's like, hey, look at all this content from past armored cores and i'm like wow it's just like one except for you made it look better whereas the two games that came after one were just one <laughs> which I, I i'm so conflicted i'm so conflicted on the thought of games like these uh-huh because on one hand i've always like i spent my entire youth like poor mm -hmm. so i didn't like the fucking notion of I got this $40 armored core game and then, or 50, 40 or 50, and then bought two more that are just so much of the same content. Right. Feels weird. But then there's the thought of like, well, if you really love that, you probably want more of that. Mm -hmm. That's a very strange situation, gets then. Mm -hmm. The games that came after were expansions. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like the, um, not Extreme Legends, but the other ones. The, the ones that are even weirder for Dynasty Empires? Warriors. Yeah, Empires. I feel like it's a lot more like the Extreme Legends, where it's like, here's some new missions and the new characters. But this has, this has mode stuff. Like, the original the original one didn't have a ring. That's true. It does yeah. have new modes. And there there is additional story here. So to me, it feels like if they just, like... And I felt the same about Empires slash Extreme Legends. Even as someone who loved those games, it was like another 50 or whatever for right it doesn't feel like you feel like you're in red yeah like i wanted an actual new thing that was that back in those days we games came out the rate of like full games come out of that. yeah <laughs> that, that statement didn't really say much um it, it, they came out at a faster clip yeah. than they do now i mean we just described by the end of the ps2 they have 10 armored core games right whereas I don't think a single 7th gen franchise has hit 10 games to date. <laughs> Probably Assassin's Creed. Maybe. One of those years had multiple, look for you. By the way, I, I know what you're talking about. Like, yeah, it is, it is just they're doing one a year. But what we're trying to convey to people who aren't used to that, because some people, either they forgot because it's been long enough. Yeah. Or, you know, uh, are young enough where they never experienced a time where it was like, yeah, we used to have games come out really quickly. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a hilarious intro to a review by Brad Shoemaker <laughs> for Jack 3. Where he says the long and storied franchise of Jack and Daxter is coming to a close, and at that point it was all of three years old. Yeah, it was and you're insane. Like, you're like, wow, that's holy shit. Atelier had seven games and six ports since the PS4 launch. Oh, eight games. Close. Yeah, I guess Assassin's Creed has Assassin's Creed skipped a year ever. I don't think so. Was there Assassin's Creed last year? No. Yeah, no. So I that was the recently one year they So then that would mean they technically hit 12 or 13 oh. at minimum because they had they had the two different versions. Like the fourth game. Right. You know, they had Black Flag and then Rogue. There you go. They skipped after both Odyssey and Valhalla. Really? Yeah, those giant ones take longer. Yeah, imagine that. I you know, right? Oh, wow. What a surprise. These games that are 80 to 90 hours long that they say won't be, and then they are again. There might be 10 Ratchet games since 7 Gen. No. Well, maybe if you count the PSP games and all the weird spin-offs. Maybe. Maybe he, he would appreciate it being in a big arena like can... It's like, I want to see the fishes. <laughs> but yeah, I, um...
I don't know. It feels weird. I'm very curious for when we get back to, um, you know, when we get back to the uh, PS2 armored cores and I get to see those sort of spin-off titles, you know, Ninebreaker and Last Raven, how I'll feel about those this time. Right. You know, when we spend a hundred dollars <laughs> on Ninebreaker. What if Ninebreaker's amazing and I start questioning? Maybe I should. Right. That might be the worst thing possible this month. I already spent about a hundred on PS2 armor core games, but it's three of them. Right. Not one. <laughs> right, not one. And luckily I think two of the three were in complete box, or maybe three of them. I don't know. I don't know. Nice, got him. <laughs> then Dan starts saying nine sweeper. <laughs> it would be pretty cool if nine breaker was the best. Nine breaker's not worth $100. No, I assume it's not because I played last Raven and I traded that in immediately. <laughs> Even as an Harvard core fan, I'm like, what the? You want me to transfer in my save file to have a fucking prayer? Are you insane? The Dark Cave Arena trivialized most encounters in case you're having a lot of trouble and basically giving up like I know I did. Okay. I really think FromSoft hit their stride with the PS2, though. Oh, absolutely. They were putting out a ton of games. They were all pretty quality. And they were all pretty diverse. It's weird how their Xbox offerings are the weirdest and kind of like less... Like, I'm not as enthusiastic about their Xbox games. Like, Otogi... Well, I guess Metal Wolf Chaos is cool. Yeah, Metal Wolf Chaos is cool. But really, I when I think their Xbox games, I think about... When I think about their Xbox games, I think about their 30 frames per second games that gen. Yeah. Like, you know, the sequel to Evergrace that they won't <laughs> call Evergrace 2 in America. <laughs> Speaking of which, I need to buy that at some point in time so we can actually finish a playthrough of it. Absolutely. Because I'm world's number one ever, Grace fan, I guess. This is just me and Thor high heels. We're doing the predator handshake. <laughs> it's really good when you watch his fucking video that has Evergrace in it. I wouldn't say it was a video about Evergrace. <laughs> um, <laughs> and he just talks about how fucking annoying that one dungeon is because you have to get on the spinning, the rotating platform and wait for it to swing the whole way around. And if you're going to the right instead of the left, that means you have to wait for it to slowly do 270 degrees of movement. And then you get off and move to the next room, which has another one of those. <laughs> Very funny. Ninebreaker only has skill trials and arena battles. What? Okay, Aquira, what is a skill trial? I cannot fathom how they could make an armored core game that felt like a Dark Souls game. But I feel like if they did, as a Dark Souls fan, I would still appreciate it more than the uh, 10 years of nothing. You mean as a... Just, oh, as, a as an Island Core fan, I would appreciate it more than the 10 years of nothing. Jesus. No, don't play Forever Kingdom. I played that through an emulator and that final boss sucked ass. I'm sorry, Maxi. I, I'm too into fucking Evergrace. We have to. I mean, we did that giving games a chance for it, and we played over an hour of it. And, you know, some parts were neat. But overall, I'm like, man, this sucks compared to Evergrace. Yeah. <laughs> Visually, it's weird because it's a PS2 game that looks like it's trying to be an Xbox game. Because it <laughs> runs at 30 and has certain texture stuff that makes me go, why isn't this an Xbox game? This is a half hit with the sword. It's just going to be one hit, but he's so quick. Okay, you were there. Got it.
But yeah, Bob, maybe. Yeah, what's up? Maybe we just keep the uh, the ranking video exclusive to give Boost Prime's patrons until we can get another ranking video done. <laughs> and then we release it right before the other one, so that way people have any other ranking video to watch. Because <laughs> Rush Tickenberg is a simulation of what people searching for a Gears video are going to think of that video. <laughs> I don't know if I, I especially like the sound of that occur. <laughs> That's awful. It sounds pretty awful. We may we may just choose to not beat that game this month because it doesn't I wish I could bring in the laser gun and I, the the finger. Yeah. 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 Uh, come on. Does anyone know if you have a crouch to use the uh, chain gun on your back? Any other back weapon that I can Yeah, use? I'm pretty sure Dude. you have to crouch, yeah. If it's like two, you have to crouch. <laughs> there are five trials by type, attack, defense, move, technique, special and overall and you get us bronze silver gold medal depending on how well you perform the unlocks for getting gold medals are hidden parts and more trials wow. that's what nine breaker is that in arena content wow all right we sure will boot that game right it's like game made for sickos clearly a career says yes unless you have human plus for the crouching thing. Oh, I see. I hate rockets. Would you be okay with me trying this guy eventually? Sure. Can't get him this time. I feel like I got his name. I mean, you got a pretty significant lead. Ooh. Ooh. See, Rush Tickenberg wishes nothing but ill will upon us. Uh -huh. Because if we get too popular on YouTube, then people will just parrot our opinions about Gears <laughs> without playing it themselves, even. <laughs> and he'll just go insane. He'll be like, no, you don't understand. You didn't play Gears. Three's fine and Ko's hot. And everyone's like, who's Ko? He's like, oh, shit, wrong franchise. Damn it. Fuck. <laughs> God damn it. I said I wouldn't do it again! <laughs> but you are popular. I saw you had a video with over a million views. Does it really have over a million? Does it really? Because I assume you're making a joke about RRR, but I'm worried <laughs> that Labyrinth Sex has over a million views. <laughs> Because I do not keep track of it. It has a... Labyrinth Dust has over yes. a million views. Oh, that's insane. I should have forged a fucking document to just be like, yeah, he said he was fine that we run ads on it. Now stop being an asshole. Yeah. YouTube, uh, a billion years ago, had a really weird rule for one week. One week, they had a really weird rule, you guys, where they were like, you need written consent from the people who originally made this game to run an ad on their thing. There should be some way to, like, undo it now with everything. But, you know, YouTube, it's the same cryptic. It's a fucking nightmare, YouTube is. Almost 1.3 million views. Thanks, Japan, you horny bastards. People are like, that's, that's, that's racist. Why would you accuse Japan of being the source of that? I'm like, I'm not accusing. I've seen the analytics. <laughs> In the last month, that video only got 333 views. Ah, oh, wow, okay. 
It's finally done. Thank God. Check out the monetization page and see what it says now. Oh my God, Bob. What's that? Finally, now, here, in 2022, I can run ads on this again. Now that it's getting no views. Yes, thank God. Stupid bastard. It's just slightly behind me. It's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> so you're going to get paid for those 1.2 million views, right? Yeah, that's how YouTube works. Yeah. You know it, man. Mm -hmm. Where's our Where's our YouTube trophy? Want to have that? Yeah, that's that's a good question, actually. They're never gonna get us that shit. No. This video is being monetized. It has been reviewed and confirmed to be suitable for most advertisers. <laughs> Alright, dude, whatever. Holy shit, how many ads is that? The fucking 14 minute video, they shoved four ads in it. <laughs> Jeez. You know what? I think about breath laser gun here instead and got him in this arena. He actually would just go down either. Yeah. That, yeah, I think you're right. Yeah. Let's gonna do that and then you can take okay. a turn if, if that doesn't work at all. Okay. Sounds good. Uh, whoa, whoa. We sure got one subscriber in the last month from that video. <laughs> What do you mean we had 42 returning viewers for that video? Bob, that means somebody watched it. Uh-huh. 70 bits. Oh, and then, boy. And then they went back and watched it. Oh, thank you, Maxia, for the 70 bits. 70 bits. We would have made way more than 70 cents. Let me put it this way. If we were running ads on that, we would have made a grand. A big laser gun. There it is. Thank you. Excuse me. You better do more videos like that for that one subscriber. <laughs> Dan, I'm getting tempted to watch this video. No. Don't. No. Yeah, no. Because it's terrible. <laughs> it is a terrible game we're playing, and we are less funny. Because mm -hmm. that was years ago. People are like, you get less funny? <laughs> I know, right? Unbelievable. Fuck. <laughs> How did you live? It's only nine years old. What do you mean only? <laughs> That's all. Have you ever seen a person and gone, oh shit, they're like... Exactly like they were nine years ago. I know very few people I could ever say that about. That's okay, Dan. I mean, it's all my retro. Everybody's just screaming. It's called retro. That's forever in YouTube years. Yeah, actually. I mean, shit. I was having a conversation with Bob where I had to explain the modern meta of the algorithm. Because before, you would never want to make a video that was huge. That would, that would deter people and the algorithm. But then that changed somewhere in the last four or five years where it's like, no, 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 make a video that's over an hour long. Please. That's what people crave. Which is why even though originally I was going to make the Gears of War ranking video two videos that were a little over an hour each, like Red Letter Media does stuff, I realized, just make it one gigantic fucking video. <laughs> We 
What do you mean I donated 420 bits this week with only 70 bit sounds? It's <laughs> pretty funny. See, and that's why we're billionaires now. Yeah. People don't even realize how much money they give them with those 70 bits. <laughs> It would be really funny if we did end up doing a Kingdom Hearts month. And then we do a ranking video. <laughs> and so many people we know go, This ranking video sucks! Because <laughs> they have opinions. Yes. I personally can't stand myself after 20 minutes, so I try aiming for that from number personally, says Justice Act. Only enough to remember when you couldn't upload more than 10 minute videos. Do you remember 15 minutes right after that where we we're like, oh my god, we get five more? Well, I don't know what happened this time, but he went insane. It's like, I'm just gonna start hating. <laughs> All right, here you go, Dan. We were making a video, it was a big project. Uh huh. And Bob had finished editing and everything was done, and the video goes up. And these motherfuckers go, YouTube allows 15 minutes now. You didn't have to do it as two 10-minute parts. And if they had added it up, it still would have been longer than 15 minutes. Yes. But it was also like, yeah, we've been working on this for a little bit. Damn it. <laughs> Frank video would have amazing engagement. It's true. Yeah, no, it's true. I, I really just, like, it's not even about that, right? It's about a commonality between what I want to do and what the internet wants to watch. Uh huh. This, this guy's good. Yeah, no, he just turned on. I don't know what happened. He, he's activated? Yes. Why rocket? Because Mrs. couldn't hit him no matter what. He's too fast. So I was like, well, maybe. Oh, cool. It doesn't. Shoot. It doesn't aim down, actually. <sighs> Short shoulder weapons, am I right? Mm hmm. Well, that's cool, Kiyosuke. Okay, got the 15 minutes early. <laughs> got to do those a little bit ahead of everybody. Great. Man. Every time I see people talking about, oh, yeah, I used to watch YouTube on anime, or anime on YouTube and little chunks, I'm like, I'm no, sorry, you did didn't. You, guys... you just didn't know better. Yeah, uh, I was like, <laughs> no one made you. Uh, I watched so much anime back then, on, you know, via torrents. Right. <laughs> like you just—that's just, that's just what you had to do. Right. That was how how things worked out. <laughs> that's the only way they could. Yeah. Yeah. Like before, those things like that took off. Otherwise, like, wasn't gonna watch YouTube freaking like. Man, I, I would have started watching anime like that before YouTube existed. So, of course, I wouldn't switch to that. Experience getting rinsed a couple dozen times by a single armor core. They pretty win at random because the AI decides it just doesn't. A little less insane. Yeah. 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 I had to watch an extremely low quality TV rip of Dragon Ball on Real Player. I've been there, Rustickenberg. I yeah. remember something I watched like that. Bob seriously out here being like, why don't these fucking eight-year-olds know about BitTorrent? I know, right? It's, it's ridiculous. <laughs> you fucking idiots. What are you, children? Oh, wait. <laughs> yeah, it was really cool when we let Google buy YouTube. Yeah, it was... It got so much better after that, you guys. It was great. Oh, uh, it's... Uh, Yeah, I know. Shut up. I remember getting an anime ref and putting him on PSP back in the day. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that was the shit. That is good stuff. Google video being a thing. Yeah. That was a thing. Yeah, it was. 
Uh -huh. Anybody ever tell Google we're tired of this shit? Are you trying the finger? Yeah, I'm trying to give him the finger. So we're down to the last five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. He's... He has been compared to an eagle. It's like, but that's not a, a seagull. Not an eagle. I know, right? What the fuck's wrong with you idiots? His that was funny. I did not realize it took away community captions. They did. It was infuriating. And it was clear they just wanted to sell you buying uh, caption as a service. That's insane. It's like... Yeah, they suck so bad, dude. This is from shop. They love misspelling and mistranslating things. I mean, I oh, feel yeah. like it's not a love of that. It's more of a consequence. No, no. They definitely love it, Bob. Don't be a hater. <laughs> <laughs> this is an art style. See, Bob, you just you just gotta have these legs so that way you never slow down. Uh huh. It's funny, I, I uh, didn't take him here with these legs. So. No, I guess I did for once. And did a very similar strategy that just didn't work. But you have the laser cannon, may that help. It was just a matter of I got him down to really low health, but now and I have to couldn't land with the missile. Yeah. 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 Between that and my patience, I'm really hoping this will work out this time. Why isn't this like battle bots? Always ends in like 10 seconds. It was at first, you know. It was. At first, there was some strong battle bots energies <laughs> to us in the arena. Yeah, just like that sort of stuff where they like community members make captions. I feel like they could. I don't know how the system worked. I assume that the actual content creator got to review the captions, or if they didn't, then they shouldn't be any fault of their own. And YouTube shouldn't affect uh, do anything to them. Either. Right. That that's in a sane world. Yeah, but you never know with YouTube. Yeah, because YouTube basically isn't run by real people. It's all fucking shitty boardroom member shit and then AI. Right. Like real it's humans. almost impossible to contact a real person for the biggest... But yeah, one of the like my channel the disappeared. Internet. Right. Which is insane. It's like any any real business can this, hire freaking people to answer a phone. Right. You're telling me the third largest company in the world can't afford to hire people. Right. I don't even hear the sound of him hitting me. No. He's that good. Chat, do you hear explosions? <laughs> this is a legit question. I think the left speaker may have come unplugged. Hmm. Because I'm not really hearing left sound. I'm, I'm mostly hearing it center right. Okay. There should only be one analog cable over there. Oh, it's one of those. The thickest one. Who that? This combat feels like when I try spying a fly. Luckily, flies don't have a laser cannon. That is pretty luckily. Okay, I have an idea. Yeah. I have an idea. I have an idea. What's up? I'm gonna sell some of the shit. Okay. So I can get a Gatling gun that I shoot while I move. Yeah, my work. My work. I'm really hungry. 
gonna eat some sort of candy or something. See, you should have gotten the extra protein. Actually, it is flabbergasting to me that I'm not hungry again. We've been live 10 hours. I assume I have shit for money. Yep. Are we wearing the better arms? What are you? Oh, okay, never mind. Carry on. That's nah, okay, Noodle. Uh, since I got up, I've eaten three times, so. I sold the plasma rifle because it wasn't working out. Yeah, I woke up at uh, 6 a.m. Have a little monster as a treat. I actually don't have any here. All I have is that weird, like... Ghost energy drink blue raspberry sour patch? I think that's I think it's sour patch. Yeah, I think I've had it for like ten months. Probably drink it or get rid of it. Actually, I think I got it back in February, so. See, I haven't tried it. I bought it to try it, but I'm always scared of trying a new energy drink or doing anything weird dietarily speaking before a stream. That's how you end up with a twin snake stream. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, pizza. Nice. No, I've not had a Lonnie energy drink before. But yeah, when you do streams this long, you don't want to take risks like that. No. So no Gigaboots eats roulette stream? Jesus. Yeah, this sounds dangerous, especially if Eric's involved. <laughs> okay, Eric, eat this ice cream, and he's like, God damn you. <laughs> It drives me insane that the, the arena doesn't have an actual ranking that you climb. Mm -hmm. It seems like you critically fucked up the idea. <laughs> yes, you can just be like, I want to fuck going to any of you. We tried the C4 Starburst candy drink. I think that was the other energy drink I had in there. Oh, was it? Or had at some point in time sitting in a, a fridge. Just do coffee if I want my stomach to be stable, but I need energy. Yeah, coffee and energy drinks really hit different, I feel. And then Dan remembered he can just fly. So if anyone was wondering why I might be scared of Armored Korma, uh -huh. how Master of Arena is going is exactly why. The people who it, who put in the playtime on the fucking how long to be are the psychopaths. Yeah, it's like, it'd be really good. <laughs> and have a great mech already. Right? Can't tell you any progress? No, we've been stuck in this one fight for a while now. I mean, you beat the last guy, you beat the Thunder, dude. The, okay. But we've been at this guy for a bit, yeah. I need to try some of the other areas. Yeah, absolutely. Because that really helped for the last guy. On um, that place that he couldn't deal with that well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, every time you say it's arcade, I, I don't. I forget that there are arena names.
Oh yeah, Aeon, I noticed that. I don't know what's up with this guy and why he changed his tactics so much in the last few rounds. It's fucking weird. Cool. He's learning. Well, let's go look at those other levels. Here's this cool pencil drawing of a raven. Yeah, they don't have names on this menu. Yeah, we only have five dudes left, and then we have to fight Ninebreaker, which, given all the rest of these dudes, I have no idea how that's going to go. Nineball. Nine Ninebreaker. Nine balls. Can't give him much pillars in the way to make him confused. That's the dream. To me. Except that it says, oh wait, not this one. <laughs> Let me check a sec. Oh god. That's okay, he seems to be wasting his entire payload against this pillar. Right. That's pretty cool. Ow. Ow. Shit. He found out how fucking object permanence works. I'm doomed. <laughs> not good again. It's not fair. Yeah, no, I haven't figured that out. That's an unfair advantage. <laughs> Really? You're already up here. Man, yeah. I feel like there should be late types in this game that turn really fast. That'd be nice. Have to download the entire game. <laughs> it's oh. gonna take a while. Oh no! Keep swinging. Oh, jeez. Stop being the same color as the walls. Right? Lord. Yeah, maybe Rig doesn't need to beat Master of Arena. No. <laughs> maybe just Armored Core 1, actually. <laughs> we'll find out tomorrow when we get to, uh... When we get to Ma Mask of the Phantasma. <laughs> Someone in chat the, called up the name of that, uh... Noah game, like... <laughs> The Reverie. Yeah, it's something yeah. of the Lunacy is Veil. Phantom Isle or whatever. Phantasma Mile. <laughs> Wahoo. Maybe it's a different dark area. Okay. We can check out something else. Development. This level ain't working. No, and I don't I don't know exactly. 
Yeah! There were a couple moments where I feel like if I better took advantage of it and had my finger ready, mm -hmm. then it could have worked out. Bob, I just remembered. What's that? We're also meeting on Tuesday for five. Yeah. 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 Guess I'll just die. I'm going to check for a parking garage. Okay. I'm just not sure like what is the massive strategic shortcoming of our mech yeah this dude just seems like he's on cocaine right that's big and dark too and it does seem to be parking garage like thing with pillars right throughout let's see This is why the original plan was don't promise to be any arena game. Right. And if we beat this, then we can say there. The only one we didn't beat was, yeah, this is this is stupid. Yeah, this is great. He just not broke his to... fucking AI. Jesus we Christ. We really needed a, a ceiling that will just end his life. <laughs> and we'd just be like, we did it, except for Ninebreaker. Yeah, low ceiling. Yes. Okay. So this is the one you were talking about. That makes perfect sense. And which Armor Core soundtrack is your favorite, Axe Umbra? Next. Because <laughs> not only does it have its own soundtrack, it also has the remix soundtrack. <laughs> is this a parking lot? Yes. This is parking lot King Hearts right here. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I just beat it with over 8,000 health. Yeah, because it's just like, oh, I hit my head. I hit my this head. This is what I get for not searching around to see if some level's fucking stupid and breaks his AI because he's an idiot. Oh, my. All right. Hopefully that just works on everyone. The only four. What a waste of time. I know, right? What a waste of time. <laughs> okay. This game is funny. Absolutely. It's funny in the way every FromSoft game is funny. Yes. He couldn't get through the glass ceiling. Well, it doesn't help that the glass ceiling was cement. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> You tell them it's okay. Ooh, you've got mail. Oh, they're going to pull us no. out of the fucking... Here's a request from your sponsor. Please read the description. It appears that your skill and rating Raven increased. It's just a matter of time before you'll be allowed to enter the arena. <laughs> not what we're... Doing? Not the real one. Flash. Yes, he's bipedal. We're good. Oh, that's a really good insignia. Believes that victory should be achieved with style and class. Prefers fancy weapons. Pilot, Flash, AC, Light Maker. I feel like I've seen something just like that. Oh, they didn't say doing, in the they didn't email. Say in, in last time, she was like, hey, don't ever do that again. Well, that's, that wasn't her. That was Proctag. Oh, wait. No, that's her. Yeah, it's definitely very Picasso core. What the fuck is... It'll just be a matter of time before you're allowed to enter the arena. Was their way of saying, you've been removed from the arena. Go did, do a job for us. Did you save before this? No. Hopefully this mission isn't anything too bad. Dude, no no mission in this game. Well, okay, just the sub has been. Yeah, the sub has been, been insane. the last two fighters. Yes. I'm sure we'll be fine. Who, who knows? Maybe we could take the sub on with the finger. Huh? Maybe. <laughs> no, absolutely not. A secret material developed by Proctech was stolen. We are still investigating, but it appears as though the culprit may be the wolf. <gasps> a ranked AC sighted nearby. 
Last known location of the thief was in the vicinity of Fort Garden. Your mission is to search the abandoned mine and recover the stolen material. At this as this request originates with your arena sponsor and is a priority mission, your arena challenging rights temporarily suspended. <laughs> you could have covered that over there. Does look like the finder icon. That dude's logo. 100%. <laughs> I am the mighty finder. Combat system engaged. The enemy's fighting capabilities are unknown. Be careful. Like a regular level. Yeah, this just feels strange. I worry I don't have enough bullets. I should have put the laser gun back on. Oh, that'll be fine. <laughs> yes, did you? The handler literally told us never to do missions like this again. But now she's like, hey, you do it. So maybe she's hacked. Well, I don't know. I went through her. She, we did go through her. On the menu, yeah. But that's what I'm saying. Maybe she's hacked. Maybe that's not really. My god. Man, this is another really good song. Yeah, this game has good music. Done? Um. <laughs> okay. It looks like there is a wall behind that thing blocking my vision. Uh. I see. Got those other paths. Get out of my way. Like, are we actually having to kill something or just collecting that material? I wasn't uh, clear. Collecting the material and killing that guy. Okay. Really just killing that guy is what it sounds like. Isn't there a song a lot like this in a much later armor core? Probably. Okay. It's like, it sounds familiar, but different. To me, it's just a big hole. The amount of check the map to see what room I'm in and what it even fucking looks like is pretty high in this. Okay. I don't care. We're going well. There are also back parts that give you more ammo, Bassie. You haven't seen those. Oh, yeah? I assume that doesn't work for, like... Oh, yeah. Is that in... Is that in this game? I knew that was in later ones, but I hadn't seen it. Yeah, I didn't expect it to be in this. Because if the huh. finger could have more ammo, that would be pretty nice. That would be fucking unreal. Plus, you mental mass like this, yeah. They're really cool. This map is not ideal, but hey, it's, it's actually it's cool. the only way. It's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> yes, it is right behind you, actually. AC verified as the wolf ranked 14th in the arena. It looks like he's guarding the door. Keep moving in order to avoid fedora? I don't know, man. Um, does he dodge ever or? No. Oh, that's a no. That's a, that's a big no. I think he had a tank and not a quadruped. Um, I guess he needs to find the door, I guess. There it is. So about how I'd never find that because of the field of view and how the environments look. Your target is that container. Retrieve it. Okay. Battle over. Combat system disengaged. That dude was really powerful. Absolute nuts. Yes. I don't know how I was supposed to deal with that. Right. Other than pull out a gun and just shoot. So, okay. <laughs> so where's the boss? 
Hmm. <laughs> we don't know. He's gone, man. He never showed up. <laughs> What's up, mail? Congratulations, your registration is complete and you're hereby certified as a contender in the arena, usually a potential candidate. 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 <laughs> Must wait until the contender leaves the arena, but an opening was available just in time for your registration. Concentrate your efforts in the arena for the time being, but keep in mind that we may still require your assistance in future missions. $50,000 and whatever the fuck that is. Looks like a sniper rifle. It's pretty cool. Um, so everyone's telling us, hey, go get the thing. That lets you have more ammo, and I'm like, yeah, if I had known that was the thing, we would have fucking got it by now. Magazine? Magazine! Here? So we agree we just get two of those in the finger, right? That makes sense to me. We're so smart. Oh no, we can't afford it! What can we sell? Literally anything to do that stupid plan. Right. We have two sets of arms. I think we're using these, which are just better. That sounds right. 201, got it. This is such a hilariously stupid plan. Let's go. Oh my yeah, god, I still... Need uh... More money. Don't we have two generators still? We might need to go buy pedal again and balance it, but you know what? Let's just assume that this is our peak form. We also have two heads and we never use the other one. Oh, uh, yeah. This is such a great plan. It's so smart that we did this, Bob. This yeah. is gonna work out perfectly. <laughs> Absolutely. Here we fucking go. This can totally hold all these, no problem. We're just Rambo. <laughs> Back full of fucking ammo. I, I guess we could get a radar head if we really wanted to have a radar soon. I mean, yes, we could. It did help in some of those arena battles. Spider Rambo, yeah. What a smart game. Yeah, no, this is unbelievably stupid. It is going to go poorly. I'm so excited. <laughs> but you're right. We could get ahead. Uh, let me see. Okay, none of our ship's limited. The only problem is money. Because <clears throat> we're now, you know, flat on our asses. You're right. Well, let's, uh... Let's sell this. We can just buy back HD08 dish. We need to. A sensor radar function. Here we go. No, it's just barely good. I don't think it has radar. Does it not? It's so the same. standard. Radar type, radar type standard. Okay. I, I so used to random things only being the text at the bottom. I just started only reading that for these. <laughs> Oh, yeah, no, that shit's... Fuck that. Okay. Cool. No, we have a tiny so head. That hilarious. It's very small. Very small head. You just look like a dude wearing a mask. Yeah. I should say. Oh. Oh, it's... Oh, hey, we're in the real winner. thing. But we can fight him directly now. Yeah, there's Hustler 1. Jesus. Okay, time to save. What the hell is with the way they set up those arenas? I don't know. What is their damage? I wonder if it now works like a proper fucking arena and we can just challenge the people only directly above us. Possible. Hopefully not. Hopefully it's just like, come here. <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, these two magazines better let me just piss ammo. Yes, absolutely. Sounds like it's gonna give us only, what is that? 800 bullets total, which might be enough to squeeze us over the line on a lot of these guys. Yeah, a lot of it was like, I was down to his house and house to now. If I had, if I had just another 100 bullets, he'd be dead. 
I think there's a mission. No. Okay. There are no missions. Okay, so about how clearly the end of the game is arena. It just got rid of every mission in the game, even though we didn't do them all. Right. Okay, so I'm going to try to just challenge him directly. Yeah, the challenge button doesn't seem to be there. Yeah. We, could, we should have just challenged those dudes out of order and found out there's weak ones when we got beat. Bob, I did the... Uh, oh, you're, you're, yeah, that's not a bad strategy. There was the thought that they're going to make you be... Yeah, we what? figured we'd have to beat all of them. Yeah, you need to fight really Oh, much. sorry. I thought my brain farted. I was like, that's me. You take I'm the yellow. Did you go to the parking lot? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I it I just leaves it. it on whatever one you did, Lyles. Yeah, there's no way I'm doing any more matches outside of that parking lot. That would be insane, <laughs> given what we went through. 700? That's not 30% times 2. How far away is it? Fuck it. What if I was here, asshole? <laughs> Check. There's, in fact, no other Dark Cave Arena. I was just really, really wrong playing the game only once four years ago. Does that. That's fine, XM. We figured we found a place. <laughs> we found a place. I'm not done. <laughs> Wiki was wrong. Are you telling me someone on the internet did math wrong? <laughs> What would that be then? Because it's 500 normally, right? Yeah. So that would be 20% each time. Yeah. Stop, he's already dead. That's not going to make me stop. That's only going to make me want to do it more. <laughs> Most mass on the internet's wrong. It's true. Evan Bug Collect. Just I add I invite everyone into my parking garage. Yeah, and they're like, what do we do? I don't understand. And then I hose them. And they're just like, what is going on? So Bob. Hey. I think by the end of the day, we'll end up beating the other game an hour faster. And this one an hour slower. Probably. That makes sense. Because of that insane block we got stuck in. Right. Shit, 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 shit. The real trick is getting anywhere near them. Yeah. Once you find them, they can't handle it. This is a little too close for my taste. So close to have ammo. It's okay, he only needs 77 more damage. I'm more worried about dying! <laughs> yeah! Nice! <sighs> My god. Jesus Christ. <sighs> it sucks that they do the replay thing. Yeah, I know. It's like Please pop up with the menu to ask me if I want you to load that much to do a thing that I won't want anyway. Yeah, there's very, there's basically no game I want to see a replay immediately after. Like, Gran Turismo also does that. It's like, okay, well, I'm moving on. This is neat. It's but. helpful for the trial. I like saying it for the trial. Sometimes. This feels ludicrous, though, right? <laughs> it should just be like, now fight 14 dudes. Yeah. And I'm like, okay. That sounds like a good set setup, AXM. Just basic energy rifle with expanded ammo so it can hold 202 shots. Oh, God. I didn't even think about expanding that ammo. For some reason, I was like, it's energy. That wouldn't expand. Right? No. It, it just worked. And we lost this thing about doing that with our really good rifles. Like, yeah, a lot of times it's really just, I needed 10 more bullets. Uh huh. Hopefully this is rinsing us several people in a row. Yeah, as it turns out, you have to fuck up my am pretty goddamn hard for this to not hit you. Right. 
Yeah, this is Power Wash Simulator <laughs> now. I'm just spraying their fucking suit and painting a dick in it. <laughs> They're like, no, my beautiful insignia. And then it's the one that looks like Picasso, but there's a dick heading for the mouth. They're like, no. How could he do this? You made my, you made him my mech again. <laughs> and then I spray him and then I leave. <laughs> Can't, you can't even hear the good music before they die so fast. What are you talking about? I'm hearing beautiful music right now. <laughs> I love the sound of the shotgun going off. That looks like a cool thing. Bad. Moon. You used to be a yo-yo champion? All right, Spin Kid, let's fucking go. No, no, no. That's O parts, not O parts. <laughs> it's completely different. <laughs> Our Stickenberg said we have to cancel the Gears of War ranking video, Bob. Oh, no. I know that we've spent at least 10 hours, 11 hours on it so far. Uh-huh. I really like the song. It's a good song. Ranking on records would also be pretty hard. So far, it'd be fucking easy, actually. Yes. <laughs> yeah, no, the AI cannot deal in this pack parking garage. I feel like this was literally a godsend they just sent us. I never said cancel. I just said that I would watch it. No, you said cancel. I saw it. That was real and it happened. And there are no jokes happening right now. Then was like, no, no. <laughs> then you guys are gonna get canceled, and I'm gonna, I'm cancel. gonna cancel you. We'll see who cancels who. Whoa, Giga Boots! <laughs> it was really weird when Stickerberg said that. Yeah, it was. I, I, I he used I to be that. such a nice boy. He's hanging out in chat all the time, talking about coal. <laughs> That's definitely what he did. Nicknamed the Shadow, this AC uses its blade effectively and is able to vanish from radar. Ooh. Fade. The pilot's name is Fade with a Y. <laughs> yes, Calvin. Most of our course have story missions and stuff. This is an arena game spinoff. Yes. That's why there's so much of this content. Where were you when Gigaboots got canceled? <laughs> uh, canceling, though. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, there's a lot more variety to, to our record than what you're seeing tonight. And this is an expansion for a while. Yeah, this is a paid, paid, paid expansion. Yeah, it's a PS1 game, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay, come on. Come oh on. no, he's come fading on. away from the radar. I hope I don't just shoot him a hundred times with the finger. How about I give you the finger? You give me my fucking trophy. That's me anytime I'm playing a PS5 game, actually. He's fading from radar, Bob. I can't see him. Where is he? I fell asleep. Where are we now in the arena arc? Uh, we're in the real we're, arena now. We're in the real arena. I think we're on rank 11? Something 10? like that. Around and the there. stupid asshole's major trick is he does this. He stays just barely out of my line of sight. It's like, oh, isn't that funny? I'm, I'm invisible. No, you're next to me. <laughs> sure, yeah, let's race. Yes! <laughs> what a fool. I actually ran my ammo to zero right at the end. Then I would have had a stab. <laughs> well, bored. That's the name of our mech. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I like when I name things things, and it's just gives me an excuse to hit a button the entire night. Yes. It's always really good. I'm glad they started putting it on screen. It's great. <laughs> have you fought patches yet? No. no, he should be in Last Raven and or Ninebreaker. Oh, no. Red no. Oh. Emergency situation has arisen. We have an urgent request regarding a mission for you. Please read the de request description for more info. So, Bob, I'm going to change this back to the laser rifle. Yeah. If we, if we take that into a battle, we'll be perfectly fine with two, Bob. That's true. Yeah, like no one is so 
perfect as to dodge that thing, except for people in the arena. <laughs> Oh, wait, right. I can't because of the leg. Yeah, you'd have to switch to the other legs, which you may be able to still do. Not sure if we can hold that many ammo cartridges with the normal legs. Uh, we can just barely hold uh, cartridges. Uh, there's got to be a way out of this. Um, you can take the lightsaber off, maybe? I don't know how heavy that Let is. Let me just rip my head off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I also do not know how heavy. It's pretty heavy. YOLO, Jim, let's fucking go. <laughs> Seems like a bad idea, but I'm excited for it. Patch is ranked nine in the master arena. Oh, really? Cool. Yeah, I don't need a head. Only people who think need a head. I'm going out there with two ammo casts and, and the laser gun. Does that sound like I'm thinking? <laughs> you know, Bob, it's been approximately 10 years since you've done a mission in this game. Would you like to sure. take this back for whatever is, is going to happen? I'm very excited. Saving data. Saving data. There we go. Let's see what this mission's all about, guys. Yeah, I am really sure. <gasps> Defend laboratory. Emergency situation is risen. Our laboratory at the center of the city is under attack by unknown forces. The invaders have divided into several small groups and are attacking the different routes. We assume their target is Elon on Elon Uva's lab. Maybe some connection between these units and the ones that attacked our marine lab, but we aren't sure. All four gates leading to the laboratory <laughs> are located in block seven. These key locations must be defended. Okay, we're gonna fight MTs to defend the gates. I got this, guys. Bob's gatekeeping. I am. Um, my power. <laughs> I wish I could gatekeep. I'm Combat not system game. engaged. Combat system engaged. Gatekeeping begin. Enemy units detected near gate three. Destroy them immediately. Hey, yo, there's some enemy oh, the units to gate. <laughs> Detected near gate three. Destroy them immediately. My god. Okay, there's a six. And I see bullets. Oh my god. Come on. Got him. These act there's so many numbers around, but units detected near gate one. Destroy them immediately. I don't see a number on the gate. Let's turn music here. Detected near gate one. There's so much Destroy good music. Give me some during this mission. Oh. Hey, stop that. I'll shoot the gate if you don't. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. These are not the mechs you said I would be fighting at all. There's one. I like when you shoot them right before they hit the ground. <laughs> <laughs> like, it literally looks like they're.